abomination. My prince, what are you doing? Are you blind? What does it look like I'm doing? Well, in case you are, I'm just um, here testing out my future throne. You know, reacting how to rule my people, how to execute orders, and how to, you know, change the system. It's a taboo. It is not done. No one is allowed to sit on the throne as long as the king is alive. What you've just done will bring misfortune on the kingdom if it is not cleansed. Well, I am not, um, after all these useless uh, traditions, I cannot wait to assume the office of the king. Once that is done, you see me changing so many things, starting with the stupid ass tradition, telling me it's not supposed, it's a taboo, it's bullshit. Okay, wait till I become the king. And I'm going to change so many things, starting with maybe you. What is going on here? Nothing much, Father. I'm just here taking a chew pill, trying not to be up on the hill, you know. Reacting how to rule my people when you're gone. Because very soon, my father, we will know more. It will be left for me to govern my people, starting with, you know, how to. Is that this your crown? Kambi, what is wrong with you? About what? Why must you always want to talk? So this resting I am having a little piece of mind here now is telling you that you want to talk. Kings do not talk. Kings act. You are a king for crying out loud. Stop talking. What is it you want to talk about? About us. We need to talk about our son. Oh man. What is it you want to talk about him for? We have to handle him. We have to handle him before he completely goes out of hand. Did you say handled? Look at your face. Why do you talk about my son as if he's a curse? He should be handled. Really? Ebedike? It's because of my son you squeezed your face like that so wickedly to talk about him in that manner. My son is living his age. He's a young man. You cannot live your life. I want to live someone else's life. Okay, babe. You okay, but what? Is that all you have to say? Give me a machete. Let me go and cut off his head. So that you have peace and wear that your cap properly. Excuse me. You don't have one anything with your life. When he completely goes out of hand. Do not blame anybody but you. my dinner late. Today again. Take your time. I haven't had breakfast. That yet to serve my breakfast. How brazen. Are you even mad? Is this how you're supposed to serve your husband? But you're not their husband. They are a maid. They're we not your wife. Teach. No, no we need to teach them the lesson. They need to understand that home should not be run like that. Take it easy on these girls. They are girls. Don't have to flog them like that. You will enjoy them. Mother, 
Mother, you're not going to say anything. Haven't I been talking? No! You're just going to let him go after treating those girls like that? Candy! This what is delaying you. Oh no, we shouldn't have bothered with cola nuts. I'm not a stranger in your house. Mm. I'm mm. not a stranger in your house. you know me. Mm. That there is no way I will be discussing anything with you here with empty mouth. That's no problem. Mm. Let me not uh, offend you. Mm. But honestly, I'm afraid of what the future holds for this village. How do you mean? Ah. It's about our prince, the future king of this village, when the father is no more. Wait, what about him? Uh, Wait, what has he done? You are asking me what he has done. He has done virtually everything wrong. As a matter of fact, uh, you know, I couldn't believe what my eyes saw yesterday when I went to the palace to see the king. I saw the young man comfortably seated on the throne. Huh? Hello, Carlo. Hey, Obaka, this is serious abomination. Exactly what I said. So what did the father say? What could he say? Huh? The young man, he walked out of me and his father, the king. Amba. And both of us, we became speechless. Unacceptable. This is unacceptable. In fact, Completely an abomination in our land here. You know what? I'll have to go with you now to the palace to see the king. Yeah? Come. Just give me some few minutes. Let me go in there and put on something better than this so that we'll go to the palace and see the king. Yeah, it's better do. It's a, it is said that his teaching time says nine. Let us handle this issue right away before it gets out of hand. Egypt, well, amen, one, one, amen, I love that I want you all to make sure he does not eat meat again. Yes, Your Majesty. Sabika Satwantio. Yes, Your Majesty. I don't want to hear one single complaint again about you. Yes, Your Majesty. You can go. Look at me. Are you not ashamed of yourself as a mother of that wicked and wayward prince? Are you going to tell me that you have not heard of the news circulating like wildfire? At your age, are you not ashamed of yourself to be listening to gossips and idle talk at this your age? I thought you were more sensible than this. Have little sense. Age is not sense. If you will shut your dirty mouth off. How dare you insult me? Are you okay? Are you insulting me, Ogu Gwegwe? Oh, Your reign is over. You should be. You, in fact, you are retired. Ogu are you insulting me? Uh, if she insults you, what will you do? Oh, what will you do now? Huh? Asa now, what will you do? I can see that your mother has spoiled you to the extent that you do not know the difference between ages. So how do I expect you to have regard for elders? That's this old man's one king. Huh? So I am arrested. You will soon die. All you need is to at least this, this small years remaining for you. Leave it happily and stop making noise in the palace. Simple. Stop complaining. Eh? What's all this? Your time has come and it's, it's, it's gone as a matter of fact. Why are you stopping my mom? 
Huh? Why are you disturbing my mom? I'm asking you. Old witch. What do you mean about that? I don't have your time. Mom, please come. I want to show you something. Oh, no. After ransom or backing, you can just go. Oh, wow. You know that you're old. Yeah? You oh, well, mom, mom, mom. It's good everybody should have you or her own children. Go mind your own. Hey! Gold of my ancestors. Will you just fold your arms and allow this rat rule over this kingdom? Mother. Mother, please. Don't take this matter to heart. I beg of you. I beg you. I will speak to my son about this. This nonsense will not happen again. No, I will not. I'm sorry, no, mother. No, I will not. What is wrong with that stupid thing? In human clothing, he is full of pride. Beware of him, he is a beast. Young girl, the prince demands your presence now. I'm sorry, I can't. I'm in a hurry. Is something wrong with you? I said the prince wants to see you now. Ah, uh -uh. is it by force? I said I'm in a hurry. I can't see him. What's going on? She's proving stubborn. Proving stubborn. Hey, young lady, do you know who I am? No, I, I can't see you. I'm sorry. You're not coming. Yes. <laughs> Are you aware you're talking to the prince of this land? If you want to see me, come to my father's house and see me. I see you anywhere I want to see you. Guards! They shout my name like I go Jericho when I did backyard. Now, what did they happen? Moa, Alpha. Moa. Alpha. Eh, hey, Alpha now. Nah. Adora. Ma. Me. Alpha. Miss Obado, what were you doing at the backyard? Oh, I just they arrange uh, some of my personal things. You might go boxers, all those things. <laughs> yeah. Adora. Biko. Whatever you are doing there is not my business. Biko, go to the farm and bring back my son, Kobia Zuike. Tomorrow he can continue. Mama, Mama, you're the one spoiling this boy. Yes. Allow the boy that like going to the farm to go and walk. You will not allow him. Me, I don't like farm work. You will not say I should go to the farm. Ha. Mama, stop being it. Oh. Allow him. Mama, I don't know. Allow him. Mama, stop it. Oh. You will not say I should go to the farm. Ha. Mama, stop it. Oh. I don't know. I'm with you on Sega. Shut your dirty mouth. Let's do thing. I don't know because you're going to go to the farm and bring back my son. Let him come and eat and rest. Period. Eat. Yes. Ha. Mama, I've not eaten, no. Hey, can you go to the bottom? If you like, eat. If you like, don't eat. What's that wrong? Mama, eh. Mama, this thing you're doing is not fair. Sometimes... Adora, go and bring back my son. Get out. Ha. <laughs> Mama, sometimes I just wonder whether you're there on colors. But no problem. Mama, where you gotta drop you? You know, 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 you Yeah. 
crying. <laughs> now, what's in the apple? <laughs> now, who beats you? <laughs> and I did talk to you, my friend. Make you talk to me. Now, why you just won't walk out past like that? <laughs> They cry now. Please. Please, who? <laughs> Adam, make you the cap now. Why you can't they keep quiet? They do like small picking. This is the priest. That boy. <laughs> what did that boy do you? I don't talk to me now. What did that boy do you? I, I, I can't say. You can't say. <laughs> I go show that boy. That boy boy in bone on a cole colo. Eh, mate, ya, eh? Mti che and wear na utu ada su ora English. E wata go, ma wea na mwa bo adora. Eh, nga we ya TV on an air. I feel about his arrogancy to our people and the way he has been maltreating our people, especially our girls. But don't worry. Nge tia ya Z world, u put an in one slow motion. You wanna go? It's you. Stop that. The prince wants to see you now. What have I done? Call me if you, if you need that. The prince wants to see you. They told you I want to see you and you're asking them what have you done. Are you questioning my order? I don't understand. Any problem, my king? You're still asking me if there's a problem. That's... My prince. Do the need for Okay. But I am I too small now that you couldn't notice the prince of this land? You are sorry, my prince. You have to sir. Turn, 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 turn that fire, you 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 and your useless generation for, for, for not bowing down to greet me. Good afternoon, my prince. Hey, are you mad? And you're watching. Come on, come, come on, on. Come on. Bring that boy. Come on, do that. Are you mad? Are you realize you are talking to the prince? Come here. Bring him, bring him here. Come on, move. Go down, go down. So, who, who is your father? Leti Chienamdi. Leti Chienamdi. Oh, your father just um, so lucky that he's late. He just saved himself from an agony. Eternal pain. But nevertheless, handle him. Mwaka. What is holding them? Adora. Adora. I hope she didn't go somewhere else. Instead of baby Zilia. Hi. <sighs> Mama! 
Ok, n'est quoi? Till then, Mama, Mama, leave me. Come inside now. Leave me. Abaka, this is where I want to be. Adora. Adora. Ha. <laughs> uh, young lady, stop crying and tell us what your problem is. Your yeah, one just did. I've come to see for your intervention. I am an orphan and this is my only brother. Just look at his face. He said the prince did this to him. <laughs> did you ask your brother what he did to the prince to attract such punishment? He didn't have to do anything. Yes. The prince does not have rights to beat him or order anybody to beat him. He doesn't have the right whatsoever. Get the prince Yes, the prince is not yet back for his story. Young lady, I'm very sorry for what happened. I will look into the matter and uh, know exactly what happened. Okay. Um, take your brother to the pharmacy. I'll take care of the treatment, right? Thank you so much, Your Majesty. May God reward you. Let's go. Your Highness, I think you shouldn't bother yourself about this woman's talk. Everyone knows you as a soft-hearted king and will want to take advantage of it. What do you mean by that? Huh? Also, what do you mean by that? I'm asking you. You mean the lady we just concord lies against the prince? Is that what you are telling us? Your Highness, one humor. It is enough. I will handle the prince myself. Better do, Your Highness. But please don't just don't mind him. That is the way also like for closing into matters that doesn't concern him. 
I'm seeing that Tracy is becoming too much. Go about my back. That's why go back. Yeah, I'm going to 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 go back. Papa, Papa, it's been you I've been waiting for. You see that prince, that old Chaka Omaka, I'm on so dead man. I swear he will collect. I will finish him. I swear to God who made me. I will finish him. Adora, stay out of this issue and do not bring trouble to this family. Papa, don't tell me that. Papa, trouble day. Trouble come wake up. Trouble jam trouble. Wait till be. What? I go give that prince war. He will know that my name is Adora. He cannot dare to come and lay his filthy hands on my brother. In the grace. No, in the gym wire. In the mud. If I give him just this my breast. He go hear him. I go finish him. He go see. It's your stupid, stupid prince. Adora, just wait. Adora, just okay. wait. It's okay. Hey. Hi. No what? But online. We need to talk to the king. Kambi needs to be cautioned. Eh? Hmm. I need to go to the palace again. I speak to the king about this. That boy's character is not good. You know what? It's not good. Uh, 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 Adora! Adora, come back here! Come back here, Adora! Come, come back here! How are you? How was the story? Oh yeah, it went well. Uh, we said something about this. No. But all the same, I noticed something about the people of this kingdom. What about them? They don't need to be given soft landing. They need to be given strong hands. Of where? Strict with them. Of where? Yes, we need to put them in place. Let them know that the rulership is not. Where have you been? Were you not informed I was looking for you? Uh, not yet. I just got back and I'm having a, a chat with my mom, as you can see. What right do you have to go about the community? Beating up people. Your Majesty, what is all this about? You just got back. Woman, stay out of this. You're the one that gave him the impression that he can do anything to anybody and go scot free. He's the prince. Now, Kamdi, answer my question. Did you or did you not order the guards to beat up a boy today? Oh, that? Oh, yes. I call that discipline. You know, same thing I was just discussing with my mom. We need to give these people strong hands. Imagine that boy passing me without greeting me. You know, ah, the prince of this land. You must be mad. Did you hear me? You, you must be mad. Did you call me mad, fast? Mom, can, can, you, can you hear him? Will you stop that, Kamdi? Kamdi? What's that? Will you stop that, Kamdi? Why will you be talking to our father like that? Why? Kamdi, come back. We are not done talking. Look at this stupid boy. <clears throat> can you see your son? He has not grown wings. <laughs> You now have the guts to walk out on me. Are you surprised? No, like, are you shocked? You think it's that little boy you used to throw up? Nah, Kaka. He is now a full grown adult. He is no longer a baby. You are calling him mad simply because he exercised his conjugal right as the crown prince of this great kingdom. That's why I'm calling him mad. Calling your own son mad. Being the crown prince does not give him the temerity to go about maltreating his subjects. How is he going to treat his subject tomorrow? So you care about the feeling of others and not that of your son. If you know what is good for you, leave him alone. He is my son. I know what I went through before I had him. Please. 
Ebedike, stay away from my son. Talk to him. Hmm. I said, talk to him or I'll disown him. You heard me right. Onewi, mother, do you know you are the reason Kambi is insulting father? You're the one supporting Shut him. Shut up! If you don't know what to say, shut that hole on your face, else I will shut it for you. Mother, are you mad? Better talk to him. He's overstepping his boundaries. And if he doesn't watch it, boy, better talk to him. Better talk to him. Shut up, boy. Be that thing. Are you waiting for me to tell you to be? Hey, who? Hey, who in Azada? I'm a man of my own. I'm a woman. Garbage. Shut it down. It is only a stupid mother or an ignorant mother that sees the face of her son and says everything is okay. What is wrong? What is the problem? Mother, you know what is wrong. How can I be happy? I have been on this throne for 11 years. Look at me. I'm not getting any younger. I do not have a heir to the throne when I join my ancestors. <laughs> Yes, I know. And I also know that whatever is happening is not your fault. It is not. You know very well that right from the very beginning, I have been against this marriage between you and Ugebe. My son, won't you at least listen to your mother's advice and get another wife? Mother! I hate it when you bring up this issue. I will not marry another wife. I will stay with Ugigbe, my wife, and get the solution. Very well then. Good, if that is what you want. If that is what you want, that is what you will have. But let me tell you something. I am not getting any younger. I need a grandson. Do you want your brother to take over the throne? Search your mind and give the answer. I like break my legs. Break my toes. I cannot come down to do that. Little scream, mother. <laughs> Anyone who sees you will think you are an accomplished mother of a dozen children. No one will ever believe that you do not even have one. Queen mother. Hmm. Mm. I don't know the problem I have with you or you have with me in this palace. I have tried everything within my power to avoid your incessant quarrels. Yet you won't let me be. What have I done wrong? Am I the gods that give children? Or did they give me and I ate them up in my womb? Can you please stop? Okay, I need grandchildren. I need a son. My son needs an heir to the throne. Look at you. As beautiful as you are. So empty. Give me grandchildren. Is it too much to ask? Why do 
did you say that happened? You needed to see the way Queen Mother embarrasses Queen Gig with this afternoon. What did she tell her? She told her that if someone sees her, they will think she's an accomplished mother of a dozen of children. Seriously? But why would she say such a thing to her? If you ask me, who will I ask? Anyway, I pity her, Sha. I pity her. But do you think the fault is from Queen Ogebe? You're asking me as if I'm the doctor. Yes, now. She needs to ask you because you're the one that always brings you to this palace. Eh, 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 eh. Just stop it. But I wasn't hearing people were discussing that kind of thing. I wasn't here. I'm not okay. Hello, my queen. You, you look terrible, like a storm that is about to blow. What's the problem? Everybody can. Yes, dear. Did I force you to marry me? I was in my father's house, happy, living my life. You came to ask for my hand in marriage. Officially claiming you love me. But right now, I do not feel that love. I don't see it. How do you mean? What I mean is that if you love me, you protect me from your mother's hurtful words and actions. Your mother is practically strangling me to that that I don't have children. What is it? Why should it be so? My dear, do not take whatever my mother says to heart. Like every other mother, she's just worried. Really? Why she should be worried on my behalf? Am I the only woman that has not had children for her husband. Am I the gods that give children? My queen, come on, relax, okay? Mm -hmm. My mother will soon get tired. You, you married me and not my mother. Then prove it. As long as I am not bothering you, Whatever any other person says should not be taken seriously. Tell your mother to stay off my back. I know where I'm respecting her. Tell her to stay off my back, off anything that has to do with me. Tell her! He, he, he hasn't got into that. It will soon get to that. Trust me. All right, I, I know you are upset, okay? Cheer up, my queen. Come on, cheer up. I want you to accompany me to a neighboring village. The king invited us for his royal banquet, and I want my sweetheart to be there. What if I say no, I am not going? Oh, you have the right to say no, but I will not accept. <laughs> Come on. I am talking about you. I love you. I Excuse me, don't feel so disturbed at them staring at you like that. You look some kind of 
familiar to me, you know. Ugebe, right? Queen Ugebe, for crying out loud. Oh. I am a queen, and who are you? It's, it's me, Honora, right? Honora, yeah. Good job, Honora. Honora, your first love, the one you abandoned. <laughs> but, but I'm still okay. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Where have you been? Oh, my oh, goodness. Don't, don't, don't come, come close to me. I see. Honora. Uh, yeah, it's me. <laughs> it's been a while. Where have you been all this while? Well, I've been exactly where you abandoned me. <laughs> so, what, what, what exactly? What in the God's name are you doing in the freaking you know, gate like this? Uh, what's going on in? You came here for a royal banquet, but oh. the crowd is enormous. Oh, I see. I was getting so. Tent. So I said, let me come out here oh, and ease my. I see. Looking tension. for somewhere that is quiet, right? <laughs> it's you always. <laughs> oh, it's okay. I thought you were in prison. Oh yeah, I got uh, released after five years, and um, when I came out, I heard that you're now married to a king. But I said that's good because you're already queen even before I dated you. <laughs> I've always well, told you that, right? I couldn't wait for you, not knowing when you'll be out from prison. Oh, no, no so balls. So I decided to get married. I'm not... uh, no balls, all right? Mm -hmm. uh, at least uh, I'm happy that you're now married to a king, huh? So it's okay, um, um, for time's sake, huh? I, I know you will not um, cut me off totally. <laughs> oh, no, I, 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 I think my husband will be worried by now. Let me go meet him inside. Your husband is in there? No, he's in heaven. Oh, I see. Mm -hmm. uh, for all time's sake, uh, I would just like us to have a click and click, you know? It's a normal thing because I like the way you, you make Your it. Phone. Yeah, my phone, right? <laughs> You're always there. <laughs> 25 hours. Uh, that's unlocked. You still have it? Oh, my GP10. Wow. Always okay, boy. Eh? Titling and scintillating. Sweet Mama Sinta. Take Don't care of Mama. Me always, please. Oh, it's all right. Okay, boy. Mama Sinta. Take care of Mama. Take care of Well, I was quite impressed with the clothes. Mm. I felt that they deserve better polish. Well, you can't really blame them. They are not as advanced as we are. But with time, I think they will. It's just a matter of. Uh... <laughs> That's Rita. You know that one. She likes her poco. She wants to hear everything. Right now, I'm with my husband. Let me enjoy my husband's company. <laughs> it's alright. Um, mm. I wanted to eat from here. Oh, <laughs> that's wonderful. <laughs> and now we buy it from Simply. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Look. Same color. So what let me do? Ah. I'll call her back when I'm done enjoying myself. What do you mean you must talk to me? You miss me. Stop it. I said stop it. I didn't give you my number so that you can randomly call me anytime you choose to. Stop it. I am a married woman. If you don't respect that marriage, that's my sanctity of marriage. I will have no other option than to block you. Call me when I flash you. What is that? Calling me before my husband. Are you mad? No sense. Are you doing out here? You're pissing up and down. Leaving your husband all alone. You are here. What are you doing? What is that supposed to mean? When is he a crime for me to come out here and take in some fresh air? And let me, Anna Munga, let me tell you what you don't know. A woman who is in need of a child is always by her husband. Do you hear me? What does that mean? 
so I don't have a life anymore. I must always be with my husband. My elders. Our people have a saying that if you are running from elders because of bad bread, you will never have wisdom. I, both of you know that I've always looked up to you, especially in my difficult times. Besides, you have been <laughs> in my cabinet since my reign started. I am worried. I have a problem. And I believe you can help me with the solution like you have always done. Should I take another wife to get an heir to this throne? Or should I fold my hands and wait for the gods? Your Highness, honestly, you have spoken well. Like you rightly said, I have been a member of this cabinet since day one. If you ask me, and this is my opinion, I will say take another wife so that we can get an heir to this throne. As you can see, we don't have any. So I will advise you to take a wife. <clears throat> oh no, I would beg to differ. I strongly believe that His Royal Highness should wait until all other means have failed. Then he can resolve to marry another wife. As Nana and Eden Bane no gonna give me any. He is fit, if you can see. Who is talking about fitness here? Oh, okay, Joe Walker. Okay, Joe. We are not talking about fitness. Mm. Time wait for nobody. Delay is dangerous. I want you to know that. Is our king going to wait until he's old, exhausted, before he could take a wife? It's better he do it now. Even when I am old, I can never be weak and exhausted. Okay. A man is always a man. Thank you, Amanda. Well, I appreciate thank you so much. Um, a time we tell. Uh, we, we will see what happens. Thank you so much. Yeah. His mother has been pressurizing him to take another wife. He has been saying no to her all this while. But yesterday, he invited two of his trusted chiefs to ask them their opinion on the matter. But the fact is, they supported him to take another wife. What? Did I hear you say another wife? So what are you going to do? Nothing. What else can I do? Eh? Nothing? You mean nothing? So you are going to sit and watch another woman destroy you? Never! What else can I do? That is the truth. This is not the way I know. Over my dead body will I let such thing happen to you? It will not. Have you thought of solo guessing and dissemination? Look, you have to try other means. There is every possibility that the problem will be from your husband, the king. Yes. Yes. Trust me. I know what I'm saying. Rita, you a genius. Give me five. Why didn't I think about this all this while? I am. I am, my dear. I am. You have to. Which second wife? I won't let such happen to you. Over my dead body. Rubbish. Uh. Eh? 
Nothing. You mean nothing. So you are going to sit and watch another woman betray you? Never. What else can I do? That is the truth. This is not the way I know. Over my dead body will I let such thing happen to you? It will not. Have you thought of surrogacy and dissemination? Look, you have to try other means. There is every possibility that the problem will be from your husband, the king. Yes. I finally don't want to suggest that to me today. Look, I know I gave you many suggestions. So which one did you choose? The, the one that is simpler and easier for me to do. Which is? Mm -hmm. ah. You know, the, the walls have ears. So I, I want you to be careful. So who is he? He's a friend of mine. I actually ran into him. We lost contact some time ago. Wow. I ran into him a few days ago. That's good. I love your guts. Wow. I like it. Mm -hmm. but, Olita, are you sure this is not going to backfire? <sighs> Don't you trust me again? I trust you. Don't you believe me? I... It will not. <sighs> Look, I can't wait for your dream to come true. Believe me. Thank you. I'm just doing this because of you. Thank you very much. All right now, we'll see you later. Thank you. Uh, you. You look more prettier than ever. Oh no, I am not cut for that now. I am here out of desperation. That was why I picked you up. I want to talk to you. Oh, I see. So I will be glad to help you in any way I can. Oh no. My husband, the king, has not been able to make me pregnant for the many years we've been married. My position as the queen is threatened. In fact, it's on the balance. So, how can I help you? I want you to make me pregnant. I'll pay whatever it is. Once I confirm you're able to make me conceive. Oh, my GP tank. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 sorry for laughing. <laughs> but it seems you have forgotten who you're speaking with. I am not a, I'm a herbal healer, neither am I a pastor, so how can I possibly make you pregnant? I'm not a magician. I want you to sleep with me and make me pregnant. Holy Moses. Excuse me. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Sorry, I didn't see that coming. Now you've seen it coming. Uh, you want me to sleep with you? I, I still get paid. Is that what you mean? I'll pay whatever it is once I confirm I am pregnant. Can you be serious a little? Oh, <laughs> oh that's the easiest thing in the earth. Eh? Of course, you know, I'll make you pregnant because my mandala is hot and my propeller is worth it. Eh? So if I hit you there, you always come back for more. Trust me. Not a chance. So I'll never come back. I am giving you two conditions to this deal. One is that once I get pregnant and ever give birth to the child, you never lay claim to that child. Whether it's a female child, whether it's a male child. You don't know that child existed whatsoever. Is that clear? Second is that. Delete my number from your contact. You don't know me and I don't know you. Don't ever contact me afterward. Okay, forget about little talks. Of course, let's get to know each other before MOU. Don't you understand? Who cares about this, you useless MOU? Let's get down to business. I already booked a hotel. All right, yes. So let's get, let's go there. Deal. So drive to wherever you want the job to be done, then you trust me. I'll be like Mike Tyson, you know, in the roller coaster. I have booked a hotel room. Let's go there. I'm not interested in all this, your tidbits. All right. What is this 
snooze I hear about you. Thinking of taking a second wife. The, the pressure on me is, is so much. The throw me is an air. And I have to weigh the options. Your Majesty, I am not against that. But before you take further decisions and actions, I would want us to give it one last try. Mm -hmm. One last try? What about the so many tries we have done over the years? What makes you think that this trying will make a, a, a difference? Just this once. I won't ask again. You may never know what will happen. Just this once. Oh, all right. But it shouldn't be more than once. I am. I'm really tired today. Oh, come on. One round is all I need. Even a drop of it can make a woman pregnant. So let's just go. I know how you do it. You do it well. That one, one round will make a difference. Come, let's go. Let's take this to the bedroom so that it will give you all the strength you need to do it very well. <laughs> Come <laughs> to the bedroom. <laughs> Turning me on all the time. And that is why I'm your queen. That is my responsibility to turn you on, touch you where you like it more. <laughs> Come. What about the second wife? You don't need to be thinking about me. How did he go? Have you met with the man? Yes, the deed has been done already. Good. That's my queen. I'm proud of you. Rita, I am still very worried. No. You don't have to. All you need to do now is to meet your husband immediately. I've done that already. Wow. You've done that? Then you don't need to be worried. Relax and be happy. Very soon, everything will be all right, okay? With I just pray so. I just pray everything will be all right in due time. Listen, rejoice. Your prayers has been answered. You have done all you're supposed to do. Trust me, okay? You'll be fine. I just hope so. Don't I, I worry. Just... I won't let you down. Are you not my friend again? Mm -hmm. Don't no worry. Everything will be fine. Hi, she. She was busy and having this nausea feeling. Congratulations, Your Highness. Oh, um, the Queen is through with pregnant. Can I hear you right? Yes. I couldn't have an heir to the throne. Yes, Your Highness. <laughs> oh. Are you serious? I'm very serious. Let me share the moment with her. <clears throat> Your Highness, I salute you. No. Oh, oh, oh. I want to tell you that the entire kingdom, they are all happy with the development that they are seeing now. <laughs> Finally, that day we have been waiting for has come. Mm -hmm. yeah. When I have a successor, the person that we take after our king, and we have been praying for this, and we have been waiting for something like this also. Igwe, may you live long. He he said, <laughs> May your days on earth here be blessed. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you are it all. <laughs> your Highness, Hi. I greet you. We, the people of this great kingdom, have always known that a day like this will come. Eat your, eat your back. But the question on our lips was why it was taking so long. Oh. But we thank the gods mm. of our ancestors that that very day 
has finally come. <laughs> the day has finally come. And we are here to rejoice. Your Highness, we know you are planning a very big celebration. But I beg you to allow us to celebrate with this token of cola nut and this white man drink to wash it down. I know I told you. Uh, and I, can you remember? The uh, baby that won all you know, uh, uh, I have that said already. <laughs> Obaka. Oh, <laughs> hey. Uh, uh. Oh, no. I want to tell you. I just want to So that you use it to wash it down. See you, Obaka. Now I am here to see you. Okay, you have seen me. Yeah, the king sent me to deliver a message to you. And what is the message? The king sent me to deliver a message to you and to ask you why you haven't been to the palace to see the newborn prince. And to also invite you for the naming ceremony of the prince. I have heard you. Now go back to the palace. Tell Ebube that I cannot attend. He is the king. He has the affairs of the community to attend to. And me also have my private affairs to attend to. So go back and tell him that. But now, come on, go. Go and tell him you are a messenger. I am giving you a message for him. Go on before you lose your head. Okay, Get out. Okay, 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 Idiots from the palace. Can you imagine? Hi, Ebube. Ebube, asking me to come to attend to rejoice with him over a son. A stupid son he's going to hand over the power to. It's over my dead body. Look at a throne that should be mine. Ebube is sitting on it. Now he's inviting me over to rejoice with him. <laughs> hey, this boy has spoiled my day for goodness sake. Ah! Oh my Your Majesty. Yeah, I just went to see the baby prince in his cradle. <laughs> and I want to thank you for making me a father and a king. <laughs> I think I can now relax, sleep, rest, with the assurance that I now have a successor. <laughs> I hope this ends your quest for a second wife. Of course. Um, I really, really want to marry another woman. It was just a toss. Pick a call. No, I don't want any disturbance. The best erotic moment. <laughs> it's all right. Uh, let me go wait for the others. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Remember you are a king? Yes, I am. Things you don't do outside. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay. I'll see you. What do you want? What do you want? Is everything okay? Why do you ask? I ask because it is written all over you. It's like you're thinking something very deep. Okay, mother, I am fine. Some time back, you were clamoring for me to have a child for your son. 
Now I have a son yet you won't let me. What is it? Okay, what is wrong? Why this unprovoked attack? And I have a child. Not just a child, a son. So I have all the right to look you in the face and tell you exactly what is on my mind. Why Arabu Maka? Leave me alone. Learn to mind your business. Excuse me. Put one on Biko. Is it your thinking? Did you deliver my message to my brother? Yes, Your Highness. And what was his response? He asked me to leave his house, Your Highness. He said he has other important affairs to attend to. I'm not in the mood for those your own ending quarrels. Oh, so I am now the one quarreling. Really? I'm sorry, mother. But you seem to be channeling your 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 your, your energy to the wrong person. Anayo, my younger brother, have been against my rule for a very long time. He left the palace. I went to stay in the old house. He has refused all helps and, and, and offered him all the years. Just this afternoon, I, I, I sent for him. Let us celebrate. Let's have a good time together. You know what he did? He spat on my face. And I just spat on my face. So what do you have to say about that? Just calm down. You have to calm down. Take it easy on him. Anayo is not happy. And if you wear the one too, you will not be happy. And now you're not happy that you're sitting on the throne. So just calm down. I'll send for him and talk to him. Better do mother. Because my softness and kindness must not be misconstrued for weakness. Because I don't want to do what I'll regret. Calm down. As I can see, you are not in the mood to discuss further. So I leave you until when you are settled down. speak to an elderly man with some respect. You shut up. Who the hell are you to tell me that? The princess. Can you calm down? Oh, I can't imagine this kind of embarrassment. It's okay. Calm down. Nay. Uh, greetings, your royal majesty. Uh, greetings. I'm here to see the king. Oh. The king is having his siesta. You cannot see him at the moment. I hope all is well. All is not well. I'd rather speak with the king directly. He's sleeping. So I don't know. I beg to take my leave. Please forgive him, eh? Forgive me for what? What, what, what is wrong with you? Am I the way you talk to me in front of someone else? You will never see anything wrong in what you said. What's that? Why are you talking to me like that? Just don't mind that. Just don't mind that. That's what I'm trying to say. There's no way a father would hate his son. He's can't come out to him hating his own self, his own self. Mm -hmm. If you if you are good. Father, I've heard what you said, okay. Uh, I'll try to to change. As a matter of fact, I am a changed person already. Okay. And I also work on my approach to people. Okay. So that's fine. We are we are good now. Oh, I'm happy to hear that and um it gladdens my heart. I'm happy you will allow to work. I'm sorry to hurt you like this, Your Highness. I'm in anger and pain too. Why is that a problem? Whether you're pained or sad? Is that a problem? Young lady, what is the problem? 
I send my stepdaughter to get something for me down the road. Only for her to come back crying that she was raped. Not under my rule. We will have to look for the culprit. And having dealt with. Candy, please, you will take some guys with you to help me fish out that he goat who is responsible there for is such an act. Your Highness, the culprit is no other person than your son, the prince. How dare you come to this palace to lay your baseless accusation? Are you mad? What is wrong with you people? Kill Joyce. I'm telling you the truth, Your Majesty. My sister cannot lie to me, and my own son can lie to me. Take this idiot out of this place. Then you run there, April. Is it the first one that has done something? Yes. Get out. You want now what the couple since said to the This can be a fool. Get out. A woman. Leave. I give no such order. Will you stop that? Young lady, I am a just king. And I will find out the truth about this. Woman, if I find out that you are lying, your punishment is grave. It's okay, Your Highness. I'm okay with any judgment you're going to pass on this. I'm okay with it. Kamdi, you had her. What have you to say in defense of that? Wait, wait, wait. Can we all just take a chill pill and try not to be up in the hill? I'm not a coward not to uh, own up to my mistakes. Okay. Um, yeah. I think um, I did the rape thing. Okay. Um, I think I raped one of them. No, not the one already. This other one. This other one. I raped her very close to the bush. Uh, which I regret because she wasn't really worth it. It was so watery. Or salty. Okay. Or what do I say? So it happened like that. But um, it's fine. The deed has been done. Are you mad? Yeah, no, no, no. Hi! Chile, get more. Hi! What hour is this? Is it the first time? It's very it means you have been doing it all this while. No, no. no. You have been doing it all your life. Look at your face. I can see it on your face. It's written all over your face. Kamdi, you disgust me. Now, get out of my sight. Get out of my sight. Get out of my sight. Leave her alone! I don't know I apologize. But not to worry. I will make sure he pays for it. My king, what about the shame and the guilt that I will go through? I will become a laughing stock. Who will laugh at you? You have been dealing with the other men. Have they been laughing at you? When they see not they wink at you, idiot. They be laughing at you. Have you given to her? Me I go on my my wink. Are you sorry for? Now the shame I will feel. Who shame? You go to you you new newcomer in the business. Don't If it's okay by you, I will marry you to Candy. I will pay the blood price and every other expenses that is necessary. Thank you. You have no other choice. You for your type. You should have thought of that before he he, he, he forced himself on, on, on this poor girl. Get in here with the poor. Have I not been telling you? Look at how he has he, he has he has disgraced me. He has 
rub shame on my face. Majesty, my son is too young to marry this. No, 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 no. Don't even say I'm sorry for everything. My uncle man can marry Jan can't make what I pay them off. They will marry her. And that is final. Yeah. I don't find it up. It's false. Thank you, Papa, Papa, oh, you fall my hand though. Oh, now which can talk with this way you they talk now? This way you they cap now, it no make sense. Eh? Which one be say you go to the palace? They no greet you, the queen. Do not allow you to enter inside the palace. How? That is not what I said. She said the king was having his sister. I walk him as a little bit. No, no, you born having his sister. How? Why would the king have his sister now? Eh? Papa, know. see, eh? <laughs> if I go to that palace, no, 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 I will enter inside that king's bedroom. I'll go and see him. Adora. Nobody will stop Adora. me. Eh? Adora. Adora, what has come over you? Why are you doubting your father? Mama, yes, I'm doubting Papa. Yes, Papa allowed them to fool him. They fooled Papa. How would that man tell Papa that uh, the king is having siesta? No, no, you bo. Why would the king have siesta? As if as, as the king finished thinking about his people, his own self, his family, we his subjects, and he's then going to sleep for what now? On a little life and again. Adora, will you keep quiet and allow me to think? What has come over you? Papa, there is nothing you're thinking of. Papa, the truth, let us tell ourselves the truth. Papa, you they whine me. There is nothing you're thinking. Me and you know that this is your bad head. Only you in your thinking. Uh -uh. Which kind of thing be this now? Mama, see oh, I know what I'm saying. Which kind of nonsense is this now? Papa does not want me to deal with that prince. If you that prince, Papa does not want me to deal with that prince. Yes, but I promise him I will deal with that prince. You see that boy? I will deal with him. He will know why they call me Adora. What do they mean? Mama, I would say everybody is scared of him. I am not scared of him. Don't worry. Angela, that's sweet. Not that sweet. I'll come out. I will deal. I'll destroy him. Mama, I will destroy him. I don't even know what to Hey! You know what I'm doing? Say that I will marry that good for nothing girl. Now get out of my sight before I cuss you. Have you not done that already? Crossing me is like crossing the land because I will eventually take over from you. So a cursed king will definitely rule this kingdom. Does it look like I'm bothered? Well, I came to let you know that I will never, ever marry that girl. Get out of my side. I made my point. Get out of my side. Father, is everything all right? You see, your brother. I just hope he will not kill me someday. He makes me angry all the time. Father, but you know Kamdi. You should be used to his behavior by now. <sighs> he doesn't behave like a child of mine. He doesn't behave like my son. But Father, Kamdi is your son and you know that. He doesn't seem so. It is, Father. Your mother went to the palace today, right? Yes. I said it. She said the king. Yes. I talk calm. I talk calm. I know see my palace a coward. You see my palace? Hi. You see that man? If no be saying that my palace ain't go collect, I swear. My palace, they tell me say, in go palace. They no agree I'm enter. Say the king, they have in siesta. Can you imagine? Your father. Yes. Your mother came back with a uh, good news, Abby. Tell me, what did the king tell him? She said that the prince must marry me. He must marry you. You see your mother, she is very, very brave, I swear. You see your mama, I wish I get that kind mama. I will not get problem all. All this nonsense is not going to happen. Eh? By the time 
My mother and I, we put hands together. We don't finish all these people. Bono Wala, he go marry you. She be go marry him. No, he's not a good man. I don't want to marry him. In a quick. Mm-mm. He go kai You don't go marry him. He's not a good man. See, make I tell you. Whoever they don't chop, they don't chop him. Atago give na atago give. Now one nibu zi mwe lele lele. Ibu zi kaka sex. If I be a fukita na eh. Ha, it was a done dada. Yes, now. No, he did your phone to kill you. So, so can I give money in the plan again? No, yeah. Marry him for your own good. You quit chilling. So that he will not go and eat another person. You know. They hear they talk, okay, I'm not going to marry him. You know, you're saying that that boy be the next uh, king of your people's community. Yes, now. If you marry him, you become the queen of your community. Because he can never be my king. He can never be my prince. But the prince is not a good man at all. He not consign you. They don't they don't chop you if you say they don't chop you. Oh, you know no say you don't you don't you don't reduce your bright price. I don't make you use your hair though. See you, you don't marry and finish. What, what kind of talk is that? Yes, now you go marry him. You don't marry and finish you. Oh. Ha! My husband. Thunder, <laughs> thunder fire you dear in your generation. Is it this smart you use in calling your husband? If, are you mad? Who's your husband? What are you doing here? You know why I am here, so stop pretending. I'm just looking at you and thinking where to strangle you from. Is it to shoot this thing inside, inside your eyes? Or to strangle your neck? Look, if you know what is good for your miserable life, I am giving you from now till tomorrow to leave this palace. I am going nowhere. I have come to stay. You must take care of me. You'll stay in cuffs. I promise. Staying here is the best option for you. My brother will never and can never love you. He will make life miserable for you. So I will advise you go home while I talk to my father for you to stay in your house and have this baby. I prefer to stay here. Thank you so much, my princess. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. I appreciate your advice, but me, I prefer to stay here. He must take care of me. I'm not disputing the fact that you want to stay in this palace to have your child. But you need to go. You need to. Okay? I'm not going now. I don't want to go. See this palace. I'm staying here. I'm not going anywhere. As you all know, our neighboring villages have been pestering us into an inter-trade relation. I want us to know of what, what interest is it to us. We also need to know what they are offering to know if it is going to be beneficial to us. Your Highness, I think it's better we don't involve in any business with them. Remember, they were the ones who were against the learned men who came to educate us on how to improve our farming ideas. Uh, what we must understand is this. The interest they have, why would they be pestering us? Father oh, wants to see you. talk. What is the meaning of this? Something wrong with you? Can't you see I'm in the middle of, of, of an important meeting with the, with, with the elders? Uh, what, I, what I want to discuss with you is also very important to me. You see, I don't like that girl that you married for me. I don't know why you did such a thing. Did I beg you to? What about the pregnancy? Were you not the one who shamelessly forced yourself on, 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 on her that you, we, we had to force you to, to, to get married to her? Well, well, the deed has been done. We can easily send her to her father's house. Well, when she gives birth, then maybe we'll bring her back or we'll take care of her from there. You must be stupid. You want to ridicule me? You want people to laugh at me? Hey, don't give me reason to doubt if you are actually my son. Hell no, my king. Do not say anything like that. He's your son. You know he's just going... Come, did I beg you to say anything? I don't understand. 
I'm talking with my father, you're intruding as what now? Huh? Why are you held as fools? Like, I don't understand. Why can't you mind your business? Is it hard to mind? I don't know you're I'll, talking. I'll, I'll, I'll shoot this thing inside your I'm talking. Oh, shut up your mouth. It's me or no war? Huh? I'll give you punk now, you mad. Talking to my father, you're, you're intruding. Who, who the hell are you? Mm -hmm. If I come and take, take your time, I'm, I'm, I'm the business. Well, father, I've made my point, okay? That girl should go to her father's house. A war? Are we the ones you just called fools? What just happened? Or was I dreaming? Leave us now. I said, leave us now. Rubbish. Think about what I just said. You said it's uh, going through adolescence. He has actually shown you his adolescence. Sleeping on the couch. Meant to be in your bedroom. Feel like it's not back, right? No sign of him yet. Hi. Since our many years of marriage, your father has never slept out. Let alone keep late night. Maybe something held him back. Trying to attend to some things that could be beyond the reason. Is that in holding him back? That is why I'm worried. What is that thing holding him back from coming back to his house? He didn't go out with the guards. He only went with the driver. And he didn't dress in the way uh, regalia. Well, but in no, simple let's, dressing. Let's not be negative about it. Okay. Let's just go to bed, sleep over till tomorrow if no sign of him then take actions do i know my father i know he's fine okay let's go to bed come i don't on. feel right about the whole thing i have this feeling that all this is not that's well fine. everything is well okay i just You left this palace yesterday. I refused to pick my calls. You came back this morning, you're innocently walking into the house. As if you don't know what you did. Tell me, where are you coming from? I deserve an explanation from you. Is this your good money? Really? This is why I had to leave this house since yesterday. I am tired of the troubles you and your son give me every day. I need peace of mind. If you excuse me. I was sitting in it, Anna. Okay, Anna. Hey! Where did you take the king to? Where did you drive him to? No way, Your Majesty. If you want to continue working here, and you don't want me to skin you alive, even though I will try to protect you if you tell me the truth, where did you take him? No way, Your Majesty. I, I only took him to the bar. So where did he sleep? In the bar? The king was drunk, so I took him to a lady's house. Your Majesty. I see. You took him to a lady's house? Yes, Your Majesty. This same lady you took him to? If you're asked to describe her house, will you be able to do that? Yes, Your Majesty. Like I told you earlier, it's our little secret. I'll protect you. One of these days, you're going to drive me to that same lady's place. You understand, right? Yes, Your Majesty. So you can take your ass back to the house. Get lost. So you're dragging the water. I see your husband. Your Majesty. Who was the woman you slept with? Then you left the palace. Woman. 
allow me to enjoy my food in peace. You don't want me to have peace in this palace anymore? You have peace. But you tell me the truth. Are you seeing another woman? Yes. Yes, I am seeing another woman. Someone who does not bother me as much as you and your way was son. Are you satisfied now? I think I know who that lady is. It will be DK. You mean after all these years, you are still seeing that woman? What did I ever do wrong to you? Of course you should lose your appetite. When you enjoyed yourself the other night, you still have appetite to eat my food. Leave this food, I'm going to give them to beggars. People that deserve to eat it. That are, that are not as rotten and debased as you are. It is done. She will be with you in a moment. But are you sure you really want to do this? Obaka, I want to enjoy myself. Just leave me alone. I want to forget all the wahala, the problem in Paris. Go. Obaka, go. As it pleases you, Your Highness. Tell her I am waiting for her. Hello. Mm -hmm. My name is Gary Sweets. The man you sent told me you want to have a good time. Can you afford me? <laughs> Can I afford you? Yes. Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? <laughs> I don't know. I don't care to know. As long as you have money, we are good. Uh, let me ask you my question. Go on. Can you wound me? <laughs> no, can you wound your me? <laughs> yes. Outside. Outside. Yes. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 I can't. Uh, okay. Um, let us. Go to hotel. No, um, I'm Anyone? sorry. I don't do hotels. We could go to my place, you know. It's not far from here. You don't want to go to hotel? No, I don't do hotels. We should go to your house. Yes. Mm. It's safe. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I want to do jiggy jiggy. <laughs> you want to do jiggy jiggy? Can you jiggy jiggy me? <laughs> I can. Eh? Yes, I can. But eh? <laughs> <laughs> well, this one you are drunk. Are you sure you can handle me? <laughs> huh? You can <laughs> do jiggy 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 jiggy. Leave the body alone and face the engine. <laughs> the engine can jiggy jiggy you. So the engine can jiggy jiggy me? Yes. Okay. <laughs> so let's go so that you can jiggy jiggy this, you okay. know. <laughs> My beer. Don't finish it. Mm. You're already drunk. So I know mm. you cannot perform it. It's this <laughs> level of highness. Let's go. Yeah, bye bye. <laughs> okay. Yes, bye bye, beer. Okay. It's okay. Can I stand? Yes. <laughs> 
Okay. Okay. Just hold, hold me like this. Mm -hmm. Then it's a big river. Are you sure you can jiggy jiggy me? Give me water, please. We will not pass here. There is a big river here. There's a big river. Mm -hmm. Ha, you are high. Let's go, let's go, let's go. So go back. Ah, uh -uh. are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Just hold me. I can't give you. I can't give you. Who is here? Bam bam. Your Highness, Kyobaka, this is Your Highness. There's problem, Your Highness. Sit down. How serious? I need to speak to you in private, Your Highness. God, please leave us. Kyobaka, what is it? I just received a call from Beatrice this morning. Who is Petrus? The lady you followed and slept with three months ago. Oh, I remember. What about her? She is three months pregnant. Three months pregnant? What has that got to do with me? She's claiming it to be yours. Claiming it to be? Mine? That is ridiculous. Isn't she a prostitute? Why, why, was I the only man that slept with her? She should go and meet the other man that slept with her. Oh, oh, oh. She wants to use it as a ploy to extort something from me. I won't fall for her business. Because the business I had with her ended that same night. I also thought she wanted to blackmail you, your highness. She doesn't even know that you are the king. She said you insisted on not using protection. That is why she's calling you to send her money to abort it. You are sure she doesn't know my identity? That is what she said. Are you lost? Who are you? And what are you doing in my house? So you're the thing? That is planning on taking my husband away from me. What did he see in you? That got him attracted to him? Is it not this thing I see here? I see anyone remaining inside the house. I have no idea what you're talking about. Mm. Who is after your husband? Don't play stupid with me. It is only an ignorant child that plays with a snake thinking it's a rope. I am the queen. Nobody takes what belongs to me. I don't know what you're doing with my husband, the king. I don't care who you are or who your husband is. But you cannot come to my house and raise your voice at me. Hell no. Uh, leave. I should leave. Leave my house now. I should leave your house. Yes, I leave. But let me sound it as a note of warning because I see your mouth is loud. 
stay away from my husband or else. Stupid. It's all right. But I had you who want to about it. Why? I will not let it hinder my source of livelihood. You, you insisted on not using protection. And now, you have to pay the cost of the abortion. This may sound stupid. What if I want you to keep the pregnancy? <laughs> keep what? <laughs> you must be joking. <laughs> Unfortunately, I cannot keep it. Not even the king can make me keep it. I am the king. What? Are you serious about this? You... You are the king. <laughs> no. I only disguise when I want to leave the palace so I won't be recognized. I am the king. Oh, 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 oh. So it was your wife that came here a few minutes ago and warned me about you? My wife was here? When? What? Was she alone? few minutes before you arrived. And she is very serious about this. It's alright. Um, let's get back to the main issue. What are you saying? Will you keep it? I will reward you handsomely. I will keep it. Just to annoy your wife. Not to worry. I'll keep her away from you. Hmm? Better. I will send my friend to you. I'll take very good care of you, right? I'll find another time to see you. How time flies. It seems like yesterday. The mistake I made for marrying a woman who delayed to give me an heir to my throne. Rejecting my food would not stop me from finding out who you have started seeing recently. Knowing how much you despise my son. Gabe, please, would you let me help? Peace of mind. Not until you tell me who she is. Last night was the second night you were sleeping out of this palace since we got married. Who is she? The last time I remember you telling me she was pregnant for you and you had plans of making her your second wife. But you think I've forgotten all that? Keep talking. Yes, I will keep talking. Because you're planning to bring her and her child into this palace. Why is it hard for you to say it? I 
I am the king. It is my right to take decision that I think fit. Then say it. You not saying it is an act of cowardice for you to keep it to yourself. Kings do not keep such information to themselves. Say it. You a man, a full-blooded man, and a king for that matter. Spill it out. Mother, why are you crying? <laughs> My son, I am fine. It's nothing for you to worry about. No, you can't tell me that. I'm seeing my mother hot and she's telling me not to worry about it. What's the problem? It's your father. He has gone back to his mistress. Mom, is that why you're crying? My father can have as many mistresses as he wants. But one thing is for sure. No woman will come to this palace to take your place. Eh? He got her pregnant in the past night. He wants to marry her. No, no, that will never happen. That will never happen as long as I remain in this palace. No, come on, mom. This is Candy talking to you. My father cannot do such a thing. No woman will take your place in this kingdom. <laughs> My son, there's nothing we can do about it. He's the king, he has the right to marry as many women as Mom. he wants. Look at me. Omame. Oh, what did I say? Omame. Oh, Omame. Oh, Omame. Oh, yeah. Okay, so chair up. Okay? It's okay. It's never happened. To bed to your pencil, baby boy. Thanks to the gods of my ancestors. At last I have an heir to the throne. Yes. In that case, uh, let me prepare a driver to take us there. Alright. I'll do that with you. Everything I worked for just went down the drain. I should have listened to my mother. 
I should have brought Beatrice and her son to the palace. The enemy would not have had a chance to deal ruthlessly with me like it has. You cannot continue like this. That boy Kambi does not have the qualities of being a king, neither to rule this land. Himself and his mother will ruin this land. Mother, how should I handle this? I think it's too late. No, it is not too late. It is not too late. You're still strong and vibrant. Get yourself another wife. Get another woman who will give you a better heir to the throne. You, you, you're making it sound so simple. How do I handle it? When you know how desperate Kamdi is. Everybody, hey, your word is law. Your decision is final. God forbid that that boy ascends the throne of your forefathers. It is not my wish either. I can see the devil in him. He will just ruin everything that I have worked for. Oh. If Beatrice's son, my son, had not died, I won't be going through all this. Oh. Whoever killed Beatrice and took my son away will not go free. My son, forget about the past and focus on the future. Just calm down. Things will be okay. I hope you wasn't listening to our conversation. I do not care. I don't care one bit. And let me warn you. Do not be scared of this rat. I'm listening to you talk. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm listening. I'm going to make you talk. So I'm not worried, I'll soon be done. The person is telling me something very important. Yes? Mom, this is very important. Can we talk? Let me call you back, please. Yeah, me. Excuse us. Are you making meaningless call? What's more important than what I'm about to tell you? Are you mad? How dare you raise your voice at me? I am your mother. You have no right whatsoever! To raise your ugly voice at me. You want okay? Father's mistress. Are you aware he had a son for him? What? Who told you that? Well, I am aware. The son is no more, just like the mother. Lie. The son is still alive. He was just kidnapped. So wherever he is right now, he's alive. Kanti, why do you like bothering yourself about little, little things? Kidnapped or dead, they both mean the same thing. That means disappearance. Your father does not know him. He does not know your father either. So I don't know why you're bothering yourself about such stupid story. Of course, I'm not need to be worried, Mom. I am the crown prince, so I need to be aware of any threat going around my side. Kandi, can you calm down? 
My son, you have nothing to be afraid of. Queen Mother is pressurizing the father to get a second wife. She said I cannot ascend the throne after my father. That got me thinking. Is that man truly my father? Are you stupid? Are you mad? Ebedike is your father. Let me never hear this kind of useless question from your mouth ever again. No matter what his mother does, I will never let him take a second wife. Because he has an heir. And that is you and no one else. Well, that's, that's better. That's more like it. Because I would never compromise my position for nobody. No. Arrogant, so selfish, without respect. Ooh. I wonder what he feels. I wonder what he thinks. Ooh. Tomorrow is bigger than what you think. He's a beast. In human clothing, he's full of pride. Beware of him. He's a beast. In human clothing, no conscience at all. Beware of who he is. A Papa. 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 And then what is it? Uh -uh. Papa. This one where you just say uh, your mind come off from where you did. What did they happen? Eh? Anybody find your trouble? Make it tell me. Make I go change them for them. Eh? Take this place inside. Eh? I go take the place inside. But why your mood be like this? Your mood no good though. If anybody find your trouble, make it tell me. Make I go change them for them. You no know, say you you get tigress here now. Did you hear what I said? I said, take this place out. Papa, make it calm down. Make it calm down. Hey, Papa, I get something where I want to ask you. But what is that? Make I sit down. See, Papa, I want to ask you. What is that? That my brother. That uh, Alozi. What happened to him? I beg. Now my brother be that. Now my real brother. Now wait now. Like we are two brothers. That question is irrelevant. Yeah. Get out of my sight. Ha! Papa, how the question is irrelevant? Now? Get out of my sight! Papa, make you they calm down. I don't understand you, Papa. Oh. Which kind of thing? You see they change them for me? Why they change I said out! No, while I go come out, your boys, you need to answer me this question. Make I know whether we did two boys for this place. I've been a while we did. Papa, make your blood they calm down. Every day you do like this. Make, make you know you do like that. Too. Hey, your blood today hot now. Which kind of thing is this? Ah, you go just take power anyhow. Ah. Have you seen how much shame you have brought on our father's throne? If our late father Igor Kaka had messed the throne up as you are doing now, would you have had the privilege to sit on his throne? No, you won't. A king who cannot control his son. Is he expected to rule over a full community? It would be please forfeit the throne. Hand the kingship over to me. Just focus on other things. Allow me to restore dignity to our father's name. What if I don't? Anayo. What if I do not? What will you do? It's only a stubborn fly that follows the corpse to the grave. That sounds to me like a threat. Anayo, are you threatening me? Are you threatening me, Anayo? Call it threat. It will be call it anything you like. But mind you, your days on that room are numbered.
Wait, is it true that Igwe is dead? What you heard is the truth. Hi. What is happening? Hi. I mean, what is going on? Can someone talk to me? You, this evil man. You have succeeded in killing my father, right? Huh? Gaff. What? This man up in the dungeon! Succeeded in killing my father. Not in jail. Hi! William Murphy, man. Okay. But, man, you have been found guilty of murder. For poisoning and killing the king, my father, and your brother. What do you have to say in your defense? You elders would rather believe a small boy instead of me. I have nothing else to say. You already have condemned me, so. Nobody has time for your cheap blackmail. You are the last person to serve the king a drink before he passed on. So as the king of this land, I find you guilty. And you will be executed in the next full moon. That's my judgment. You will not make me childless. Anayo is my only surviving son. Please do not kill me. You and your only child of a murderer should be allowed to walk around freely. Any other punishment will do but not death. Hmm. Let's see. Okay. I think I have another punishment for him. Anaya, you are to be the king's royal tester. You are to test any food I'm going to eat before I eat it. So that if any of your enemies decides to poison you to death, I will die in your stead. I will not do it. And be prepared to die of your atrocities. Your son said he will not do it. He will do it. It is better than death. Massage is not to break it. Leave us. Yes, Mama. Oh, baby. I am surprised at you. You are not the woman that my son got married to. How can you sit? and you watch your son condemn his own uncle to death. Now he has turned him into his slave. You're doing nothing. Would you still sit down and do nothing about it? You want me to say or do something? I will not do that. You want me to play the curse of a murderer? Someone that killed my husband in his quest for the throne? Never. I will not do that. We have the feeling that my son is innocent. Yes. Anayo and his brother might be having some squabbles among themselves. They might have their own differences. But he can never, he can never kill his own brother. Never. 
lawyer, Ibama. Well, why don't you tell the king himself? Why don't you have mouth? Moronu. Orachigo. Oswe Moronu. I hope I'm not interrupting anything. My love, you are not interrupting nothing. The Queen Mother here said I should ask you to release Anayo of the position you gave him. Why would I do that? Am I being lenient by letting him leave? My son is a royal blood. He is part and parcel of this family. So he does not deserve such humiliation. And my late father does not deserve to die. Your stupid son killed my father. Kamdi, death is inevitable. Yes, you too will die someday. And you will not die someday. Sets you right. Stupid. This will be the last time you talk to me in that manner. Else I will lock you up for conspiracy. Fool. You're lucky you didn't even bait you with it. You should have baited me. Oh no, it's my fault. I didn't remain enough for you to Rubbish. bait her with it. Nonsense. <laughs> Deal with it, Queen Mother. Good for you. I will not stop until he pays for his sins. Tomorrow is bigger than what you think. He's a beast. In human clothing, he's full of pride. The seeds are there. Mom, I told you because of this man here. Yeah. He said he's your cousin. Do you know him? Yes, he is my long lost cousin brother. Oh. You're welcome, long lost cousin brother. Just make yourself comfortable, okay? You can stay as long as you want. Uh, thank you, Your Majesty. Uh, your hospitality is Pan African. Uh, I must commend that. <laughs> You're welcome. It's fine, I will assign one of my mediums to you know, make sure you're, you're okay. If you need anything, you can talk to them, okay? You can leave. Mom, yes. one of the mediums to assign you to. Hey, hey, where are you going? I'm supposed to call the maiden to take you to your room. I'll wait for the maiden. Oh, God. No wonder he's long lost. Guards! No worry, I'll take it off from there. Okay. I'll handle it. Please do. It's fine. Yeah. That's all we turned it. What does it look like I am doing here? I am here to deal with my family. What nonsense family are you talking about? I told you I had no rights over the boy, didn't I? Uh, well, you did, but uh, what you did not consider was if I ever uh, bought the idea. Now that my son is a king, he needs the attention of his father. 
and so that he support in every angle. And going by what I heard on how the former king died, I don't want such fate on my son. That's why I'm here. You're mad. Huh? Honora, you are not wanted here. Huh? I would advise you to leave immediately. Take your stupid left legs, your wobbly two legs, take them out of this palace immediately. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. I, I am here to stay, Ugobe. Let, let, let me tell you something. I will drag you to the mud if that is what it will take me to cement my stay here. Let me tell you something. My son is a king. Don't give me that tomato paste look. Baby, or what? It's me, or you see yourself as if you're a young man. It's honor, I'm out of everybody. Your first love, respect yourself, please. Respect uh, okay, yourself. Wait, remember that time that rain used to fall, and two of us will be on top of bed, and the only noise you make is, Ayo, <laughs> you should be ashamed of yourself. That was then. Now I am your queen. I don't have to mingle with you. Get that into your small school. Okay, wait, stop. Your husband is dead. Mm -hmm. And it's not as if you are going to marry the present king, your son. Just accept me back. Eh? Let me go to where I hung my dancing shoes. And then we resume <laughs> so from where we stopped. It's no, a natural no. phenomenon. No, like you are who? You and I? Stop living in the illusion. Think about something better in the future. Since you have decided that you want to stay Avoid me at all costs. Because if you do, <laughs> make sure you pay for it. Because you don't want to know what I'm for. I'm for you. I have to my hand, you should, and you should give you that. Why would you be living in the dreams of the past? Are you mad? Excuse me. <laughs> the time I've been waiting for. Is finally here so soon, very, very soon. Ugebe, we finally submit to me. Bravo, <laughs> Honora. Bra hey, I, I have a uh... An introduction to make. Quick one. Go. And call. So this person is going to be part of us. Um, yeah, very good. So he is my new special advisor from today. It's going to be part of us, like I said, part of decision making, and of course, part of the cabinet members. Like, he's going to be the king's right hand man. Your Majesty, I thank you very much for finding me worthy to serve in this Balasha Palace. I, I say thank you very much. Uh, cabinet members, I, I recognize you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Your Highness, you are a young and wise king. That's right. Your decision to choose a personal advisor is a good one. But this young man here is a stranger to our land, custom and tradition. I feel it should be better for you to choose among the cabinet members. Um, he may be a stranger, but to you people, that is not a stranger to me. And that is why I chose him for the job. Okay? So my decision is final. You don't have no right to question my decision. 
Uh, no, 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 swallow it. Don't say that. Yeah, I take a bow. What's that you can do? You can read. Oh, hello. I got that. Yeah, yeah, baby. <laughs> Wanted at palace by the king. Now, where is your sister? She's not at home. Ogeze, search the house. And you're eating. Now. Oh Lord. What happened? What have I done? Don't worry. When you get to the palace, you know what you've done. She's nowhere to be found. My friend, you think we are joking with you? You need to come with us to the palace now. But, but at least let me finish my, my food. I'm just coming back. Hey, my Don't friend! Don't you have respect for royal Stand up from the farm. Hey, move, move, move! Stand up, stand up drop that spoon. Stand up, move, move, move. What, what have I done? Don't, Don't worry, we get to the palace. Wait, let me lock up the doors. Please, are you joking with us? Adora, sitting down there doing nothing. Adora, Adora. Ha! See my guy. Make, make, make you know they call my name, oh. See face the work where you know you. You know this fan work where where. The fan work know you. You know I'm. You sabi I'm. So leave me, oh. Leave me. I beg. Who mention my name? Mama, you're not saying anything now. Mama. 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 Papa, 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 you need to come home immediately. Mama is sick. We were in the farm when she fell and now she's not saying anything. Hey, you heard it. And where do you think you're going? So we're not done with this meeting. That's right. Your Highness, it is my wife you're talking about. Also? Please, allow me to attend to her. I am the only one who knows how to prepare the drugs for our My friend, sit here. Let's finalize this meeting. You're not going anywhere. What do you mean he's not going anywhere? 
we are telling you that our mother is sick, that we need our father's help, and you say you can't go anywhere? Are you God? Come on, please, let's go. You're talking to me? Come on, let's go. Just, 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 just go, I'm coming. I won't spare you next time. I won't spare you. How brazen. Please, Your Highness, don't take what he said seriously. He's just a neighbor who doesn't know what he's saying. Because I'm taking it seriously. Huh? Oh, yes. He will pay for it. That's right. Anyway, let's continue with this meeting. Uh, you said um, we need to do it how many times in a month? It should be done twice weekly. Twice uh, weekly? From when to when? Uh, as it pleases, sir, Your Highness. As it pleases, that's what I'm asking. The way it pleases me, does it please you people like that? We have no option. You are the king. Why are you like this? Adora, come down. Come on, come down, let's find a solution. Where is Papa? That wicked king refused to permit him to leave the meeting. But don't worry, I will find a way to prepare my medicine. Let me go and get some help. But, but, but can you prepare the herbs? Yes. See, I will not allow Mama to die. Go and get me a kitchen knife. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Why is Gandhi this wicked? I mean, why is he this Carlos? Why? Huh? Amara, you are referring to the king by his name. We will respect. Mother, he is first my brother, so I will refer to him by his name. Don't do that again. The question is, why is your son such a wicked man? Why is he so mean? What has he done? Okay. Mother, a man was brought into the palace today. What was his offense? He came into the palace to call his father to inform him that his mother is very sick and at the point of death. What did your son do? He refused to allow the man to take care of his sick wife. What kind of... What, 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 just, just shut up. Huh? Amara, allow the king my son, to discharge his duties as the king of this land and stop interfering in his decisions. Ningro Kai. Really? Yes, really. You can see I was busy with my phone trying to process some information. Would you please let me be? I want to be left alone. Excuse me. Of course I will. And I wish you and you, your son, good luck. Thank you. And excuse us. You don't leave sense. Don't you know that you should be respecting your, your own brother? Protect your brother. Hey, see a man, 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 idiot.
I am not in the mood for your stupid jokes. I am not in the mood for your stupid antics you're playing. I am tired. Leave me alone. I am tired too. I am tired of lying to my son. I am tired of looking at my son in the eye and can't tell him that I am his father. Can you shut Not choose. Who will tell him first? You or I? I will not do such thing. And neither will you. After all these years, my son believes Abedike was his father. And that will never change. Abedike will remain his father till the end of time. Are you mad? Who is Ibu King? When I am alive. You are going, eh? Ibu King? Why are you laying claim to somebody, a child that is already blessed? Oh, that is what you think. That I'm not a king. In this position, I am a king. Now. I say shut up. I cannot shut up in my son's house. Do you understand what I'm saying? Uh, uh. Uh, the shipping was not um, smooth. That, that is what I mean. Son or is my father? Son... It's not what you think. Don't even think of lying to me because I have been standing right there since two minutes and listening to everything you've been saying. So Nora is my biological father. I am your biological father. For real, I am your father. So it means that I've been sitting on the throne that is not mine. Son, I am sorry. It's not what you think. You don't say things like that. You, you, you. you lied to me, mother. What other lies have you been keeping from me? No, no other lies. Everything I did, I did in your interest. I did everything not to jeopardize your life. I didn't want to put you in harm's way. I protected you with my life. I did. You protected me by lying to me? No, no, no. I didn't lie to you. You, 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 you have never asked me if uh, uh, I were your mother or if uh, Bidike was not your father and all that. So uh, there was no point in me lying to you. I've never lied to you. What is going on? I should have killed you. No, you, you, you need me. I've been your personal advisor all the while. So I'm important to you. Candy. Come here. What was it? You see this thing you did? You paid dearly for it. Pay with your life. You going to... Excuse me, Miss Honor. Where do you think you're don't, going? Oh, don't, 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 don't be around. Don't you try call me Honor. Come here again. Don't you understand the importance of time? Things have changed. So don't tell me, Honora, come back here. That is wrong. Honora! Who Honora? Ibu King. You're not going to have one here. You're not going to have one. That's your plan. You're going to sue. You're not going to have one. You're not going to have one. Mother, what is going on? Mother, what is the problem? I want to be left alone. Just leave me alone. No. Not until you tell me what happened out there. And when I'm not in the mood to talk, can you please let me be? Wait, wait. <laughs>
Young man. The king demands your presence now. Why? What does he want from me again? When you get to the palace, you will find out. But for now, to the palace. very stubborn. You remind me of when I was still a prince. I was really, really very stubborn. Should I call that stubbornness? No, I must call that strong-willed. I was strong-willed. But you know, there's a difference between you and I. I was a prince. And as a prince, I can get away with everything, anything, whatsoever. I can do anything I like. But in your case, you are nobody. So I wonder what encourages you. Thank you, Your Highness. This boy. Anyway, I've been sad. Encountering stupid people like you have been making me really angry. I've not been myself for some time now. So my advisor, you know, advised that I should employ a comedian. Because, you know, laughter is good for the soul. I need to laugh to be able to function well. So I've been thinking, who, who, who can I employ? Who is that comedian I can employ? I and mean, it's been on my mind. Okay, so, um, so you have the job, a job of a palace comedian. The job is to make sure I laugh. Anytime I'm angry, make sure I laugh. Do anything. So I've sort a hundred times. Do it, say anything. And your main idea, your main focus is to make sure the king laughs. Okay? But I'm sorry, I don't understand. You know, the problem with you is that you are daft, yet you're claiming stubborn. When I was stubborn, at least I can boldly say that I'm intelligent. You don't claim stubborn by having an empty skull. I just said something. That you will be the palace comedian. Your job is to make me laugh. Make the king laugh. <laughs> make him laugh. Okay? What? I'm not a comedian. I, I, I can't make you laugh. Your stupidity is enough to make me laugh. You don't need to do much. You're stupid already. So just add more stupidity and I'll laugh. Guards! Take this man to his room. Your job starts now. Do fast and come and make me laugh. I'm very angry. <laughs> Better think of what will make me laugh. How are you? I heard you are my brother's uh, new worker. And you are a co-jester as well. Anyways, I'm in a very bad mood. Can I hear your joke, please? My princess, are you really sure the king is brother to you and your twin sister? Excuse me? Is that a joke? My princess, because you are too gentle to be related to that beast. Will you take back those words right now? 
Are you just referring to my brother, the king of this land, as a beast? My princess, I'm very sorry. I didn't mean to provoke your anger. What an audacity. You, you know, you are such a flower compared to that monster in there. Anyway, if that's a compliment, joke, I already feel better. Thank you. What's that your name again? My name is Anozie. I am the only son of my poor father. I love my father so much. He is a good man. <clears throat> Anozie, right? It feels so good to know that your father is a good man. Okay? Have a great day. Who is that? Why are you looking for? See this one, why are you looking for? Now you get this place, I've been waiting. I beg, come on for you, make I enter. I say, what are you looking for? You know what are you looking for now? You're asking me to. Uh... You won't make I package you. No, you won't make I package you. See, eh, you're so good, and anti eh. You think you're going to take it to me? Now you're going to pass with this. Good day, Your Majesty. What do you want? Hey, I'm here to see my brother Alozi. He has been missing since he came to this place. Nobody has seen him. So we did what we do. So I'm here to see him. It's a good thing to know that you guys have been worried. You know. Uh -huh. <laughs> what are you packing? Come. I think I'll make you my wife. Isi! Excuse me. You heard me. You know, we used to be enemies, but um, I think I'll just consider making you my wife. I like the way you, you do your your the attitude around you. I think I'll just consider. No need. See, as you see me so, I diverse. My blood diverse. My blood they very, very hot. I know they're here to come talk all these things. I'm here to see my brother Alose. I won't carry and they go home. I don't know what they here they talk at them. This is what I'm talking about. I love the the stubborn aura around you. Okay? Take her to see. When you're done, you come back here. They were coming by the pillow there. Where did they go? Where did they go? So where do we go from here? What do we do? Mother, we cannot stay here anymore. No. Mother, I cannot see the chance of this throne ever returning back to me. And I cannot continue to serve under my brother's son. No, I cannot continue to be a slave to him. A boy I was there when his mother gave birth to him. No, we can't continue to stay here. Our only option is to leave this palace. Papa, you that man is a mad dog. That young man is raving mad. Mother. He will kill us anytime, anyhow, and anywhere. Mother, don't worry. Leave the planning to me. Once I'm set, I'll let you know. Yes. Are I you assure? Sure? I assure you, mother.
What happened to you? Tell me, what did that devil do to you? Greet me. He laid his hand on you. Greetings to you now. The king demands your presence now. What for? He caused the death of my wife. Why is he summoning me? Nay, do not waste our time and do not keep the king waiting. Meaning what? But do you realize you are talking to an elder? It is an order from the king. So he must come with us. No, no, no. The point of correction. Underline that statement most. I must not go with you. Go back. Tell the king that I say I am coming. Do not waste our time. Uh, I'm wasting your time. Oh, okay. Go and tell the king that I'm coming. Uh, um, the second paragraph of that uh, document is cumbersome. So if you look at it, let me scrutinize it and then refer forward to them. Oh, Chewbacca, here. I'm going to see. Let me get you something. You are the evil. You are wicked. As a matter of fact, you are a village tyrant and the worst thing to ever happen to this community. What manner of useless ruler are you? Oh, you tell me, go over there. You lost your mind? What manner of attitude is this? To talk to the king in such manner? Are you sick in the head? You keep quiet. Keep quiet, you stupid master. You think I don't know that you are the one deceiving him? Tell him to do what he's not supposed to do. Chewbacca. Let me warn both of you for the last time. Stay clear from my family. Excuse me? Because I cannot sit and watch you destroy what I suffered to preserve. Sit. I say I have better ways of dealing uh, people of this kind. Oh, okay. Chewbacca, you Chewbacca, you called me a what? The village tyrant? Village tyrant, that's what I call you. Excuse me? That's wrong. Okay. You called me this. That's right. Jumaka, you dare talk to me in that manner? Huh? That's. If I do, what will you do? What will you do? I said, what will you do? If I talk, what will you do? You're asking me. I will ask, and I'm still asking. This is wrong. Guys, do the need for Move. This is move, wrong. Move, move. We can move to the village. I will get it. I sincerely do not support what you have done to that man. Yes, Ike Obaka is a peaceful man. We all know that. And for him to be agitating like this, you must have done something to him. What did you do? Get out of my presence before I roast you. You roast me? How exactly are you going to do that? Look, let me just advise you. It is better you let that man go before you incur the wrath of the gods on your head. Are you threatening me with the gods? Uh, uh, princess, huh? Uh, uh, princess, just move before. Be you threaten me with the gods, uh, princess. Ah! I warned you. I told you just threaten me with the gods. But it's okay. It's okay. She's just a you woman. Rest your hand on me. Uh, she's just a woman. And as for you, deceiving my brother, you will pay for what you have done. Don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Don't you? Okay, it's okay, she's just a woman, but let me tell you something. You don't know nothing, so just leave. Alright? You should know by now that I have control over him as my son. The way it is. I, I, I warned you, I'm still warning you, take a leave. Or better still get lost. It's wrong for you to stand this way. Your son. Is unbelievable. How can Anuzie leave this palace and nobody is aware of it? It's not possible. Someone is behind it. How could that be? Do you have anybody in mind? I'm suspecting Princess Samara. That's true. 
because she has been close to Anozia since the king appointed him as the palace clown. To think of it, she's the only one not in this palace. I'm going to ask again for the very last time. Who amongst you released the prison I left yesterday night? Is that why you summoned me to? I do have a coaching to marry Suna. I do not trust you. Mother, where is Amara? I, I, I don't know where she is. She didn't tell me. Continue with my investigation. May God help whoever I found guilty. That person will have me to contend with. That's right. Open my mouth and hear the lie you want to hear. Greetings. Look, I have come to know how your father is doing and to be sure he arrived home safely last night. What do you want from us? I know you are not happy with the royal household, but, but I am not in support of what my brother is doing. And that was why I released your father without his knowledge. You know, I thought your brother was just wicked. I didn't know he is this evil. Did he tell you that he raped my sister? I beg your pardon. What are you saying? Look, I know my brother has his shots coming, but I won't have you stand there and speak ill of him like that. Oh, you think I'm making this up, right? Why do you think my father was locked up? Because he went to warn your brother after he raped my sister. What? See, just, just go. Leave us alone. Just go. Leave us alone, please. Just go. Wait, I'm not... Have I done something wrong? You see, respect the says reciprocal. I have been very, very kind to each and every one of you. I respect you people. I try as much as I can, no matter how busy I am to, you know, sit almost all the time with the cabinet chiefs. Right. Why do I do that? Because I want to have a proper relationship with my cabinet members. But then again, I noticed that um, you people are taking that for granted. Right. And it got me wondering. How do you mean? Your Majesty. Ichi Obaka came here a few days ago to insult me. Insulted my integrity. Called me all sorts of names. For what reason? Abused me verbally. Well, that so is I'm... because you raped his daughter. Mm -hmm. No, I am not out of my mind. My mind is very much intact. I am just coming back from Ipcheo Baka's house. And Anose told me everything. And then the man came here to register his displeasure as regards to what he has done. What did your king do? 
he locked him up. Yes. Oh. Kamdi, you have to change. You have to change from this nasty character of yours, else you will end up lonely. Excuse me. That's wrong. That is totally wrong. You are a beast. What relationship do you have with my sister? The same kind of relationship she has with everyone in this palace. <laughs> really? You think I'm here to banter words with you, right? Huh? You're forming stubborn for me. I ask you again, what kind of relationship do you have with my sister? I'm replying you as plain as I can. I'm not afraid to reply. Oh, no. are, are, you, are, you, are you talking to me like that? I'm gonna take, take this bastard out of my sight. you to monitor my sister. You must be her secret shadow. Give me updates about her. Okay? A daily report. Where she's going, what she eats, who she's seen, just everything about her. You must tell me. Okay, Your Highness. I will. I promise. Get to work. Thank you, Anders. Anders, how are you? What are you doing here? Please Just, leave. Can you at least hear me out first? Princess. Please, I don't want your brother's trouble. I promise there will be no problem. Hmm? Come on. Look, I got this for you. What is this? It's a gift. Why don't you take it and open it and see for yourself? Yes. Do you like it? I love it. <laughs> you see, uh, Princess, I wasn't actually angry with you, but your brother. It's okay. Yes. I understand. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, please, let me just hurry up and finish up what I'm doing, okay? How about you teach me how to do that? Please, please, please. You can't do this. I don't want your brother to chop off my head. <laughs> No. Just calm down, no. okay? I'm just teasing you. <laughs> There is something I want us to discuss about. 
Look, Father, I think you should drop this Your Majesty's thing, okay? Except when we're alone. The truth is that it makes me feel awkward. So what is it you said you want to discuss? Uh, it is about the, the, the mother queen and her son. I, I caught them discussing on how to escape from this palace. And I wonder what that means. I, I, I am quite uncomfortable because I don't know the type of havoc they will cause before leaving here. Wait, you mean you are plotting evil against me? I, I caught them. Trust him. Sir, come and join me. This only desire. Juicy. Keep your oranges to yourself. Caught with a pretense. What are you saying? The fact that you and that murderer you call a son plot an evil behind my back got me wondering. I have a credible information that you people are planning to run away from the kingdom. May I know why? <laughs> Running away from you, yes. Because I'm sick and tired of living like a slave. In a palace where I was once a queen. You have destroyed virtually everything my husband built. Now people live in fear. So if I have every means to run, I'll fly. Well, I do not have a problem with you running away. I only have a problem with what you're going to do when you run. So for that reason, I'm sorry I will not let you. I'm going to seize you here till, till I know what to do with you. Your end will not be better. Mark my word. You leave me to worry about that. Gas, it should be Caesar. Please put out. I told them to forward all the information to you. Just in case, if there's anyone I don't understand, I'll get back to them. Okay, very good. I'll, I'll tell them. Amara, where to? I am going to see a friend. You're going to see a friend? Every day you're going to see a friend. I, I want to know, those are your friends. Can they come here to, to, to visit you? Well, I don't know. Oh, maybe because they are scared of you. Yes, you don't know how people despise you and how scary you look or you sound. Maybe that's why no one is coming to see me. Oh, of course, that's, that's true. That's how it's supposed to be. A king is supposed to command fear and respect. That's right. To his subjects. That's right. Okay. That hasn't answered my question anyway. I said, where are you going? And I said, I am going to see a friend. You're going to see your friend? Yes. That doesn't have a name. Huh? I'm a, a friend that doesn't have a name. Anyway, that's not um, why I, I called you. I wanted us to talk about something when I'm done with my personal assistant here. So, um, there's a prince from the neighboring village. 
that um, saw you, because I heard about you. I don't know how he got to know about you, but he has made interest in you. He said he wants to marry you. And I have agreed, because um, that's what I'm looking for, someone that has... Candy, that is never going to happen. What do you think I am? Some animal that you just ship out without consent? Well, that's wrong. Well, uh, we can't push this further, because, you know, definitely I'm going to win. As the king of this kingdom, what I say is what you must do. You must marry that prince, because that's what we need, that relationship, that inter-community relationship, you know. And hopefully, it's going to lead to something uh, positive. That's right. Because they are rich in mineral resources. And I need that. I need that uh, relationship. And I am telling you, it's never going to happen. Never. If you've given them your word, you better take it back. Because I am not marrying anyone. That's not going to happen. Please, excuse me. Amara. Amara. Did you by any chance see that? Uh, uh, Did your glasses allow you to see what is happening? Yes, uh, uh, very vividly. But... Uh, Anyway, it's uh, one of those things that uh, allow the message to sink in her. But uh, for you to further uh, comprehend the situation, I will give you a powerful rendition, you know, for you to comprehend. There's no need to be in a hurry. When I was just a little child, I asked my mama, what will I be? Will I be soldier? Will I be king? Hear what my mama said to me. What's going to be, will it be? The future is not us to say. Son, I, I, I have told you before not to be so distracted about this whole thing. Uh, it's just a little time and she will come around. Uh, I, I personally believe that every problem has a solution. What is the solution? That's the problem. Uh, I will bring your mind to something arithmetically. When you enter inside a room and the flake of lights are disturbing your eyes, what do you do? You go straight to the switch control and off the light. She is simply seeing someone outside and that stands as a distraction. So when you eliminate... Let's say no more. I think I know who the distraction is. Guards! Guards! Your Highness! What the, 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 the thing needs your attention immediately. Take attention, Miss Your Highness. Run to Chiobaka's place and get me a nausea. Yes, now! Yes, Your Highness. What's that? What, what's that? Your Highness, that boy is mad. He nearly killed both of us. Which boy? No one come and speak before I cut off your head. My king, my king, we met him at home. We told him that he sent us to come and get him. And he told us to leave, that he will come later. My king, we told him that you said we should bring him immediately. And he was proving stubborn. We have no option than to force him. My king, this guy challenge us with a fight. And he messed us up messlessly. Yes, when, when he was coming out with a big machet. Very sharp one. We have to run for our dear lives, my king. Very sharp one. I think that boy is stubborn. Are you sure this boy is passed through the test of being a guard in this palace? I doubt. 
You're proud to tell me that a small boy beat you people up, King's guards, and sent you out with, with, with cutlass, and you're proud to say it. My king, huh? the boy is stubborn. Huh? Are you? Foolish girls. Look at this Adam man that do be. No, it's obvious that I'm going to change them. That's right. Okay? I will take them to the kitchen and exchange them with those maidens there. It's better for me. That's right. They have the, they have the guts to tell me that they small boy beat them up. I mean. Look at look at these girls. Okay. Very, very better for me. That's right. They're coming to tell me that they, 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 they. Let me change them now. That's how it should be. This is Because tell me why you will open the gates for uninvited guests. Is it proper? But it's why it's not good to give them free hands. Once you just slap with them, the next minute they misbehave. Huh? What, what's, what's, what's this? Your, your Highness. We are not here to quarrel. We only came here. Are you to mad to come here to quarrel before? To take back my daughter, that's all. You're here to take back your daughter. Because that's all. I won't make you think your daughter is here. Ah, Your Highness, neighbors saw the royal guard taking her away. Please, she's the only daughter I have. Turn and fire you and those neighbors. Mm -hmm. Papa, Papa, are you begging me? It's to release her daughter, else I will turn this place upside down. Keep quiet. I know that. Keep quiet and allow me to handle this by myself. Can you imagine this fool that couldn't even turn his own life upside down? You're here in my palace to turn it up. You see, this, this is the problem I have with this boy. He feels he's too stubborn. If I cut off his neck now, how will you feel? No, 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 Chewbacca. If I send my gas now to cut off his neck, how will you feel? Because this is the problem I have with him. Are you, are you proving stubborn to me? Look at this boy. You didn't train them well. Anyway, I don't have any problem with your daughter. That's right. I came to your house to look for this mad dog. Yes. This lunatic. Imagine my time, my precious time. He wasn't there. So I took your daughter instead. Till he surrenders himself, and I think that, it, that, that, that that's why he's here. But, 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 but why? What has he done? You're asking me. It's you back, so I, I should now start explaining to you what, what he has done. That's what you want, right? No, I, I don't know. I will explain to you, you back. I sent my boys, my guards, to call this boy. Do you know what he did? He fought them, sent them out with cutlass. Ichubaka, you know the customs and traditions of this land. That whoever beats up the king's guard, beats up the king. Anozie, is it true? Yes, Papa. But that's wait, a joke wait, wait, too wait, far. Wait, wait, you're asking him is it true, so I'm lying. No, no, that's what it means, I'm lying. You're asking him to confirm. I, I, no, I didn't say so. No, Ichubaka, I'm lying. I mean, Papa, Papa, they were using force on me. So, so I had to, to, to fight them back. No, 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 no. That's a joke. You carried too far. You had to fight them back. The king's messenger to fight them back. How brazen! Huh? I, I, I'm, I'm Papa. I'm, I, I'm here to, to stand for what, what I did. I don't want someone else to suffer for, for, for what I did. I think you should release her and, and take me instead. Thunder fire, you did. Were you thinking that 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 I will allow you to? Huh? No, he was thinking that I would allow him go, that he came, he came for me to take him instead. Of course you've been taken. My friend, lock this ball, lock this bastard inside, inside the cool. Please just play that. Game. Lock this just from inside. You see, you see. Before the king, before me. Don't, don't worry, don't worry. Your only son, I'll cut off his neck and I'll deliver it to you. He's I'll the only one I have. You took my daughter, you took my son. What do you want me to do? Yeah, okay. In a Najwaka. In a Najwaka. I'm talking to the Victoria Island, not you. 
By now, tomorrow, you confirm your sons and your daughters. You're talking to my. You're talking to him like that. I said my time now. Just give me what I'm hungry. Now, Papa, they come now. They come, they come, and they don't move on. You know? Nah, I mean. Ah, ah, hey. <laughs> ah, my princess. It's obvious I met you well. You met me well, my princess. You're welcome, yeah? Thank you. Uh, it's Thank unfortunate. You I can't offer you this amount. But first of all, get it. Can you hear your note? Why do you think I can't eat this? Uh, this type of food will disturb your stomach. <laughs> nice. Mm -hmm. ah, I haven't seen Anose for some days now. I've tried calling him. He hasn't picked my call, returned it either. I hope all is well. Ah, are you not aware? Ah, Nozia is at the palace. Yes, the king locked him up. What? When? Why? He said he disrespected him by refusing to go with the guards he sent to bring him. Um, excuse me. Yeah, but I please, please, don't be harsh on him. Please, don't provoke him anymore. I come out of here. I cannot go and start making trouble for her with the brother. It's been long I saw you. What happened? Hello. I've been going through some difficulties and I haven't had time for anything else. I'm very sorry for not coming to see you. But by the way, how is your head? <laughs> if I go home now. Hmm? I feel stronger and better than yesterday. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Mm, I'm recovering every day. By the way, Obaka. No. What is this rumor? Eh? That I'm hearing that you are being locked up by the king. Hi. Oh no, that is a long story. I prefer to talk about the future of this great kingdom. <laughs> there you go again. Do we have future? What future are you talking about? When the king refused to change. When the king refused to protect the people that he sworn to protect. Obaka, mm -hmm. apart from me and you, which other person do we have in this community? Other chiefs are afraid of him and supporting him. Eh? Obaka. Obaka. Oh no, you talk to me. I'm Obaka. I, I'm listening. How many times did I call you? I don't count it, but tell me I'm talking. I can listen. There is here. no future in this kingdom. Oh no. As it is now, it seems all hope is lost. But I assure you that the future of this very great kingdom is bright. Very, very bright. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> At no distant time, I believe. The storm will be over. Mm. Eh? I pray I will still be alive to see that day. Mm. Eh? But now, mm. let me talk about living. In case you go to the moon, can you go to the Oh no, nothing do you, and nothing will do you. You will be alive, very, very alive. Eh, bien, konye no eba. Okay. Shina asa. Shina Saramoku. Go in there and bring the pan wine that I have there for Obaka. Which uh, is that uh, Okoli's pan wine? Ah, 
don't worry, let me just sit up and wait for the Pangwai to come. Oh, yeah. okay. <clears throat> that is the Pangwai I need. My body, spirit, and soul needs now. I take it, I forget about my problems momentarily. Oh, ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Hi! You see, the percentage there is relatively on the average. Candy! Candy! What's the meaning of this? Have you lost your manners? As long as you have decided that this community will not know peace, I will remain your nightmare. What is your obsession with Ubaka's family? Where is Anose? Hmm? You see, one thing is for sure. You lack respect. You also lack respect to the throne of this kingdom. That's right. How dare you barge in on us where you see me having a meeting with my personal assistant? Have you lost your manners? Have you forgotten I'm the king of this kingdom? I demand that you release Anosia this instant. I want you to stay away from that boy, but you refused. So anything you see me doing, you have yourself to blame. That's right. That's then. Oh yeah? That's all right. Because I am about to take an action that you will have yourself to blame for. <laughs> what could you be planning to do? Hmm. I am going to tell the entire community exactly who you are. So you do not try anything stupid. All right? You dare not try any rubbish. Because I will finish you. That's right. Oh, yeah? Right. Well, you have until this evening to release Anode. Else, I will open my mouth and I will start talking. Your Majesty, you taught me how to take a chill pill so that I will not be up in the hill. If she dares it, I'm going to kill her. It's not yet the whole Mother! Mother! What is it? Mother, your silence. Your silence is about to cost this community its glory. What are you talking about? Candy. Candy has been messing up. He has been misbehaving since he ascended the throne. And you have never cautioned him. Not once. But I am getting sick of his attitude. Do you want to fight the king? Or let's come over here. Fight, you see. Well, the fight is an understatement. I will not let this community be doomed. I will not let my father's efforts go in vain. I will not. Tame or bridle your tongue. Or you force me to do that myself. Get out. Get out! Fine! Keep supporting him. Now I will support you. What is this girl doing in this place? Why can't she get mad? It's not crying out loud. Ah! Open this door. I need to speak to him now. I'm sorry, my princess. You can't go in. Are you out of your mind? My friend, open this door. I need to speak to the man now. The key is with the king, my princess. Who will take the place? The throne is a stake. If you make any unnecessary noise, I slit your throat for you. See, it's either you nod or you shake your head when I say something. Do you understand? Good boy. Now, you are going to take me to that place you locked up my mother. I will open and release her. Then you will personally drive us out of this community to a place I will show you. And once that is done, I will release you and you will start coming back. Is that understood? 
confused. You are not to say a word. I say if you say anything, I slit your neck. Ah! Are you alright? Oh yes, I'm fine. You came right on time. How did you enter the throne room? I have no idea. The guards have to be punished for their negligence. I think he's working with the guards. Because how come none of them are here? Honestly, I don't trust anyone in this palace right now. No, 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 you have to trust me. I, I will take charge of your security department, but meanwhile, let me look for a way to take this shit out of here. I'm not in a good frame of mind, so I'll just go straight to the point. As we all know, this man here was found guilty of killing my father, the late king. On that day, I wanted to execute him, but the queen mother pleaded on his behalf. I forgave him. But yesterday, just yesterday, this man here sneaked into the throne room to kill me. If not for the timely intervention of my personal assistant here, it would have been a different story altogether. That's right. So you see, these two being alike in this kingdom is a total threat to my reign. So for that reason, I'm ordering for the execution. So on the next Take Market Day, they will be executed at the town square. So let all the elders know that this is the king's command. The guards! Take them in and prepare them for execution. With you. Finally decided to come out of your room today. Can I sit? Oh yes, I'll be sit. What is it you want to talk about? I want us to talk about Queen Mother. I want you to think it through what you're about to do to her. Even though I've had my differences with her in the past, she doesn't deserve to die publicly like that. She deserves more. So what do you expect me to do? Call her, encourage her to do more? I don't, I don't care. No, that's not what I'm talking about. What I'm saying is that you can banish them. You can send them far away. Just very far away. Let them live the rest of their lives out there. Instead of you soiling your innocent hands with their blood. It doesn't, they don't deserve it. By the way, you made a point. I will... I will think about it and have a review if I may consider, you know. Uh, this is more like the first time you've asked me for a favor, so I think I might. I might want to think about it. I can't even believe the both of you. Really, mother? You were petting him, begging him, pampering him, instead of to tell him the truth to his face. Captain, even if the whole world is scared of you, I am your sister, I am not scared of you. And I will tell you the truth. If you do not change, I will expose you for who you are. Continue supporting him. I don't even know why I'm here. 
Mwaka mwa ya bo du du belo na amu. Ibu oya. Eko wa kwa amu. Era po pande ya. Otapu o. Apa amu. I don't know what to do with her. I mean, for flaunting my orders, she deserves a very huge punishment from me. I'm just thinking. Just, just uh, you look at the way she spoke to me. I'm still thinking. I had you hear my son's called Jester. You always make my son feel better whenever he feels down. I would like you to tell me a few jokes to lighten up my spirit. Your Majesty, I was never a comedian. I cannot crack joke to save my life. Please don't ask me to do what I cannot do. How did you get this? It was a gift from my father. Your father? Yes, Your Majesty. something from you. Yes. That assignment I sent you to carry out years ago. Yes, I know you finished that. I want to know. How about the baby? Did you kill the baby? You didn't see the baby in the room. Ego, idiot. Who did you tell? I'm not being off here. Now listen. If that thing I sent you to do backfires, it will sink us both a womb. What is wrong with this boy? Huh? Brother? Who was that? I overheard you talking to someone about a baby. Which baby? Andaline, what did you hear? I heard you saying or talking to someone about a baby. I don't know. Which baby? Must you say everything you hear? I thought you have grown up a bit. Stupid. Majesty. Your Majesty. I can see His Majesty has released your son to you. Yes, he did. And I will make sure I keep him out of trouble from now on. I'm sure you will. I have been meaning to ask you this. How did you get Anse? Because I don't remember your wife being pregnant. Anosia is my wife's uh, late brother's son. We took him when he lost his parents. I see. And the royal necklace around his neck? Now it is a gift from your majesty, Bodike. Though I protested about it, but uh, the king wanted him to have it. So I have no other option. Why? Well, he didn't actually tell me anything about it. Mm -hmm. My Majesty, I'd like to take my leave. I'll give her a little bit of a sign. It's for me there.
Without further questions. Don't, don't drag me like a little child. Can you calm down? Must you joke over, over everything? Must you play all the time? Even when somebody's dying, you're still playing. Listen. Our son's kingship reign is in danger. As I speak with you, he's in danger. What do you mean? Danger from who? My late husband's lost son. Lost? Yes. I thought that the little child was killed alongside with the mother. Can you reduce your voice? Why are you shouting? Why are you shouting? Why are you shouting? Ah. That was something I believed. That was what I believed. Until I found out differently recently. <clears throat> Do you have an idea who or where the lost son is? I believe I must hear is that lost son. Can you, can you, can you, can you, can you, can you stop? Can, 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 can you stop? Can you stop being dramatic? Can you stop? No, Kamdi, don't talk like that. This is not something to toy with. If that boy is truly who I think he is, he might raise the people against you. Oh, mom, come on. You should know the person you give birth to. I'm not a weakling for crying out loud. Who the hell is Anozie? He's on the mind. I'll crush him like this. I'll crush him. Uh, 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 yeah, Majesty. <laughs> Even at that, we don't supposed to, you know, lose, get ourselves loose. We must take precaution for unwanted surprises. There is no surprise springing up from anywhere. Right? You can go ahead and do whatever you want to do. As far as I'm concerned, he is a nobody. Abu Bedike's son died years ago with his prostitute mother. So until I see a proof, I'm not going to talk about this. Ha. Okay? Mom, leave these things for me. You trust me. You just keep calm. Hmm? Allow him to think. I am his personal advisor. When advising well. So let him think. We are thinking. Can't you understand a simple word? The king is thinking, we are thinking. It is called social intelligence. Keep quiet. Yes, Papa. I couldn't sleep. Don't worry. You will seem good to sleep it peacefully. Papa, mm -hmm. can I ask you something? Of course, yes. Go ahead, my son. I'm listening. Papa, you know I've never lied to you before. I've always been honest and truthful to you in everything I do. Mm -hmm. So I expect you to do the same to me too. I will. Papa. Who is my real father? Hmm. I have always known a day like this will come. My son, I will tell you the whole truth. It all happened 20 years ago.
Good things, Your Majesty. Welcome, my friend. Thank you for responding to my call. No, thank you, Your Highness. Let me just go straight to the point. My mother had been on my neck to bring in Beatrice and my son to the palace. I want you to do the task for me. I would have loved to do it myself, but I have a small entourage in this village this morning. Mm. No problem, Your Highness. I will go and get them without delay. Oh, uh, go in one of my cars and get a driver, okay? Maybe you should go with your own car. Mm. Yes. Nah, there's no problem, Your Highness, but I, I think it would be better I go alone. You see, you never can tell who is watching. Moreover, the words have ears. That's true. Anyway, I trust your judgment. So, do as you wish. Thank you, Your Highness. Thank you so I much. I will be on my way. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> Making the wise decision here. Who knows if Beatrice was murdered by someone from the palace? Is it wise to bring her son here? No, I will not. I will do everything to keep the boy safe. Thank you, baby. I want to this. They killed the mother. Uh, and I need a safe place to keep the baby for now. And you think our house is a safe place? Supposing the killer has followed you here. Stop complaining, woman, and do what I ask you to do. Oh, sorry. I should have listened to my mother. I should have brought Beatrice straight to the palace immediately. She and my son would have been alive now. I, 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 I wanted to wear this around his neck as a symbol that he was better into royalty. Your Highness, you don't have to be harsh on yourself. As a matter of fact, God knows the best. Our prayer should be for God to expose those that are responsible. As long as there is life, there is hope. You have to. Good things, Your Majesty. I have a bit of news for you. I am not in the mood for any news this moment. Is everything okay? Are you alright? The, the newborn are supposed to be here. You heard me. Are they not here yet? You see, what is going on? Is everything alright? His Highness needs to be left alone. Oh, that? Uh, no problem. Excuse me. Oh, 
Nice. Mm. Mm. Yeah. I should get more. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, you can take the get the get the Okay. <laughs> 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 Available. Ah, yes, 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 yes. Oh. What a surprise visit. <laughs> uh, well, your food is available. Let me ask my wife to get your own portion for you to eat. Don't worry. I actually had my meal before I left the palace. Okay, no problem. But it has been long. My king uh, paid me a visit. I hope I'm safe. Bubaka, my friend, you are safe. I was just taking my usual evening stroll. Mm. So I decided to pay you a visit. You're welcome. <laughs> Hi. You're welcome, my, Your Highness. <clears throat> I can hear baby crying. Is there a baby in this house? Um, uh, um, um, yes. Uh, it's the son of my wife's brother. Who dropped him here for my wife to win him? Oh, I see. I would have loved to uh, to see the baby. It reminds me of how I would have had my own son. I, I think my wife is betting him. So maybe when they are done. And you can see the view. Okay, I can't wait. I must be on my way. Hmm? I always wish the day I would wear this on my son's neck. You can have it. Give it to your wife's uh, nephew. Thank you, Your Highness. But you don't even know the boy. Moreover, this is a symbol of royalty. I know. It's a constant reminder of my son that I never held. As long as I keep seeing the necklace. Keep it. The necklace is very valuable and you can sell it for a good price. In fact, Take it as an opposition for me. Thank you, Your Highness. That was what happened, my son. Now I understand why the Queen Mother was worried when she saw the speed. The Queen Mother saw it on your leg. Yes, Papa. You mean the rumors I've been hearing in the palace is actually true? It seems so. Because Ichi Obaka has never lied to me before. 
And I don't think he's going to start now. And the necklace I have caused your mother to start asking me several questions, which I believe reminded her of something. Yes, this necklace. I heard that anyone that is seen wearing this necklace is either a crown prince or someone that the king wants to succeed him. I am confused. I don't think I stand a chance. Who will believe me? I believe you. And if you give the people of this community a reason, they will believe you too. You mean you stand with me against a brother? Yes. I will stand with you. I am with you. Thank you so much, my princess. Thank you. It's okay. I mean, it's high time this is reign of terror comes to an end. I cannot thank you enough. Oh no. I'm very, very sorry for this uh, impromptu, uh, impromptu visit. The matter that brought me here is urgent. Obaka. Hmm? Our friendship has grown past the level of we having time of date of our meeting. My doors are open for you to come in any time, any day. Oh, thank you, my good friend. I will not take much of your time. But you remember some days ago when we were discussing and I told you that we should not lose hope for the future of this, our village. You remember? Yes, I remember. Mm -hmm. That very future we are talking, I talk about, I told you about, is now. We have to grab it before it is too late. <laughs> Go back. That's me. You are still speaking in parables. Just go straight to the point so that I will understand you. Come and live in a But do you remember the time our late king, Ebubedike, got a woman pregnant? And that woman gave birth to a son. And he told me to go and get the woman and the son. Do you remember? <clears throat> Obaka, mm -hmm. I was not in the palace that day. But I remember you telling me that the king sent you on such errand. But you came back to tell the king that you met the woman and the child in the pool of their blood, dead. Yes, I say so, but it was a lie. Huh? Yes, I told that lie to protect the child. Because no one can tell if those people that they are there at the palace are the people that wanted the child dead. I don't know, so I decided to tell that lie to protect the child. Anyway, Obaka, hmm? that is in the past now. Hmm. Hmm? Uh, where is the prince? The prince? This is the prince beside you. So, my friend Obaka, you mean you have been with the prince all this while? Of course. What do you expect? If he had not asked me, I wouldn't have revealed to anyone. But this is a big revelation. Oh. Of course it is. But do we have any proof? And secondly, who would believe us? that this is a uh, uh, prince. prince lost son? Uh, that's a very big and important question. Just look at him. The necklace on his neck belongs to Eddie Mbedike. He was about to place the necklace on his neck when I told him that the, he died together with the mother. But instead, he decided to hand it over to me as a gift. Hi, Obaka. This is too heavy for my ears alone, no. Mm -hmm. But we have to play this with caution and protect this young man. Because the king might plan to get rid of Al Nazir. So we need to protect him until that day will strike. I thank you so much, my good friend. 
You are right. We owe it to Ebubedike hmm? to see that the land he struggled to enrich is in safe hands. I uh, thank you so much. We have to be on our way. Oba ke puo go monti o. Hi. Okay. I got. Oh no. Hi. May the gods bless you. I've been having meetings, uh, phone calls, arrangements, and everything, you know. You know, this weekend, your, your marriage is coming up, so I want to make Excuse sure... Excuse me. Whose marriage are you talking about? Ma, you know me to be very busy with my time, organizing stuff for the kingdom. So I wouldn't want to waste time talking about things we have already talked about before. Of course you know you're getting married to the prince. No. Of course I remember telling you that I will not marry your prince. I will marry a man that I do not love. Why are you talking like a child? Marriage is something that you definitely get used to. Okay? Love comes with spending time with someone all the time. Definitely you get used to that person. Honey, there is Be nothing you will do or say that will make me change my mind. I do not love this man. I will not marry Amara, him. We don't have to go on and on on this because definitely I will win. Don't make us do this. I have given this prince my word. I have promised him that he must marry my sister. So there's no going back. Don't even drag it because definitely you will marry him. Well, so sorry. just iron your veil and get ready. Prepare your stuff, your necklace, everything ready because this weekend you must marry him. Tell okay. That is not going to happen. You would have you to find yourself. a wife for your prince. I have won. You, you would find a wife for your prince. What do you mean you, 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 you've given him your words? Well, take it back. I'm sick and tired of that warm, cold and nausea. That boy has been a pain on my neck and I can't just shake him off. Now he has hooked my foolish sister into thinking he deserves her love. My sister can't even accept the man I chose for her all because of that stupid parasite. Calm down. You see, the only thing that has no solution is death. Everything has solution. Now let me ask you, as a wise king, when you come back to your living room and find your wife in the top of your matrimonial bed with a man, what do you do? You go outside and look for a stick and break his head. That's what a man does. No one can block your way. You still you block the person's way. Everything has solution. What we need is 
just to get rid of the entire family. That's all. Live and let live. Hmm. You think I haven't thought of that? Of course, I've thought about that several times. But that's going to be too much blood on our hands. So we need someone outside this kingdom. A total neutral person. Because I can't send my guards to do that. So, I am your legal advisor. Nobody's going to find any trace when the job is done. I have a perfect hand who will do this and it will be dusted. All I need from you as a king is to tell me go ahead and it is done. And as the king, I command you to go ahead with the plan. Wipe the entire family. Oh, my son, you want me to... His name is Anuzi. Uh, <coughs> the entire family, especially the boy. Uh, Oh, 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 you see, they, they, I don't know who, where you went when their teacher was teaching you uh, some economic. You, their payment will be made in full when the job is done. That is how business is done. It is called common sense. Uh -huh. Good. Uh, no, don't leave any stone on top. Uh -huh. uh, of course. Of course, you will receive a, a lot. Good. Uh, I, I, I am expecting, I am expecting answer, answer as soon as possible. Thank you. I'm alright. Who is that? There is trouble. I heard a more. Giving instruction that I'm using and his family will be killed. Shh! It's not time to shout. What are you doing? I'm close to him. I'm warning him right now. Fast. How do I? Okay, okay. 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 I shouldn't be allowed to leave the palace, so I can't even go out. Come down. Do you know what? Go to the gate, I'll be coming. Okay. Fast. Sorry to bother you. Is this a Chio Baker's house? Excuse me. Now who you be? I mean, who you define? Huh? You heard me. I said, now who you be? 
And who you they find? They say. Oh, uh, sorry, sorry. Forgive my bad manners. I am Mr. Jack. I'm Alozier's friend. But it has been a while since I saw him. Is he in? Yeah, Mr. Jack. I'm Alozier's friend. Who dash monkey banana? See, I know Alozier's alobas. He's alobas now, my alobas. Now we, we they chill together. Now my G's then be now. I never see your face. Before you come here, they say you're the Alose friend. Oga, you think I'm a more? Yeah, that is because I don't stay in the village. I only visit. We normally meet in the village square when I return. You see him? We normally meet at the village square. Yeah, except not that, so because me, I know all in Alobas. I never see you. But anyway, since now, Alose, you're the fine. You're welcome. Sit here for the go sit down. Yeah? All right. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. You go wait for. Oh, you day in a hurry. No, 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 not in a hurry. You know they in a hurry, no, Abby. No, no. Oh yeah, now go sit down. Can I help you? Help me. Helping me is like you're wounding yourself. Now why you go help Jaka Jaka like me? Can you get Jaja Jaja Jaja? You just can't get Jaja Jaja Jaja. They took one in one day. No. You know they help me, oh my dear. Oh. Welcome here. What's going on? Yeah, I, I, I left my phone at home when I was rushing to the farm. What happened? I wasn't expecting you today. The king, he sent someone to kill you and your family. That's why I've been calling you. My family? Yes. Adora. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, guys, yeah, just... ah. Let's go, my friend. Oh, let's go. Soon there, you won't hug me. Hi. Wait till they walk you now. When they do like rats, very, very bit. Adora. Why are they shake? I thought something had happened to you. <sighs> for dream, I've been a for where? Me. Something happened to me. Ah. No, they possible. Ha. Our princess. Now why everybody come day for here? <laughs> As if today na Christmas. Now wait till they stop now. Adora. This is what you just smile. Just, smile. just calm down. Let's go inside. I'll explain everything to you. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah, they go now. Ah, this is the way they have it. It's like Christmas. So. This is the shop shaking for you. <laughs> Our princess. Our princess. I beg, avoid me. Our so princess is so tall. May she just avoid me for you. Madam, Alpha, make her wait. Now, who you they wait for? Now, wait till they walk you. I beg, make you they go and say, make you wait. They crazy. You mean that you didn't complete your assignment before leaving this house? So as we're speaking now, the boy's still breathing. Well, I waited at his house, but he couldn't show up. I would have killed the girl I met at his at home, but it would have bring up suspicious. Just like you said that you want all of them dead, Jack. To exactly what are we paying you for? Is it to smoke cigarette? You should have waited a little bit longer in that place. In fact, let me tell you what you don't know. The king he will never be happy to hear this type of nonsense news. What's the meaning of this? Well, if you watch, 
I can help you. You can help you what? You have already messed up with the one they sent you and you are telling me you, you, you will help. I'm the one now they're going to clean up the mess. Try to leave. Just simple task, you can't do it. Okay. Leave, don't help anything. Leave! You can help. This little task, you could not do it. Every now and then give me my balance. When they give you your balance, it will go in between your fingers with a, a, a stick of cigarettes and a, a bottle of whiskey. And man, this is exactly what I was worried about. He told me that the person is a professional. Now nothing was achieved. Nothing. Uh, my king, calm down. Just what I need is little patience, uh, and I will handle this in person. Oh, please, I'm tired of your empty promises. I'm tired. Do something, yet yeah, nothing, nothing, absolutely nothing. Oh, boy, this work never tire you. I don't tire me, but you just got to relax, man. I know you relax, so shout, shout every year. Slap, slap every year. It's not the But what do we can do? We don't come, so don't come. No, they tell me, so we don't come, so we don't come. You can still do that. Your mate, you met the do better work on this day. Where's the princess? I don't know your eyes. I did not ask of the maiden, I asked of the princess. Where is she? I just don't know where she went to. You don't know where she went to? Come here. Come. I have a bunch of incompetent fools around me. I specifically gave an order not to let her out of this palace. Now you can't even account where she left or where she went to. Where are you coming from? Why don't you let them be? They don't bother you, yet you won't let them have one moment of peace. Why send people to go kill him and his family? I am ashamed to call you my brother. I am ashamed to call you king. My love, I've come to plead with you to consider marrying a wife. You're not getting any younger. You need to have a son that will be your successor. I have told you before that I do not want to get married. I've said that to you before. I don't have the energy or the stress that comes with having children. Okay, what about the throne? Who will take over when you are gone? Are you trying to kill me? What? What's up with all these questions? My son, listen. You need to plan ahead, just in case. Mom, see, I'll, I'll, leave, I'll leave this throne for you. I'll leave this palace for you, if you don't give me peace of mind. Allow me to rest, for crying out loud. Well, why are you telling me marriage, marriage all the time? Huh? What 
is wrong in you just getting married? You know why on your jaw? Tomorrow will be there than what you be. He's a beast in human clothing. He's full of pride. Beware of him. He's a beast in human clothing. No conscience at all. Beware of who he is. He's a Good beast. day, Your Highness. Good day. What can I do for you? Your Highness, I would like to speak to you privately. Meaning? Are you blind? Can't you see what is going on here? I can see Your Highness, but I will prefer speaking with you privately. You want to speak with me privately? Yes, Your Highness. That better be worth it. Tomorrow is bigger than what you think. He's a beast in human clothing. He's full of pride. Beware of him. He's a beast. Your Highness, uh, I have come this day to plead for your mercy. I have finally realized that I am wrong and you are right. Please. Do not in anger wipe off me and my family from the face of the earth. On behalf of my family, I have come to say, please forgive us. What is that your name? I am Ichia Ubaka. Why are you reciting it like a poem? You see, this life is its somehow stupid. For people to abscond from what they are supposed to do at the right time. This is what I've been expecting you to do. It's very simple. Eh? To come down to your level, because I don't know what it looks like we are dragging something. Are you, are you, who are you? Well, since you have come to your senses, it's fine. I, I think I, I have forgiven you people. Uh, huh? Your Highness, you are forgiving us, so you won't kill us again. That's what it looks like. Oh. I may not kill you people again, depending on my mood, you know? But for now, I think we are good. Thank you, Your Highness. May you live long. Why won't I live long before? My friend, go in there and call those girls. Tell them to come and come to your oh, thank, thank, thank you so much. Finally, we are alive. I hate people that don't have sense. Nobody commands me. And nobody challenges me in this kingdom. Nobody challenges me. I am the king. I'm sitting on my throne. Thank you, Your Highness. Dare not, dare not challenge me. My girls. I know them myself. According to your plan, I have apologized to the king and made him feel we are no longer against him. What is your next line of action? Ah. Papa, hmm? I will go to the palace tomorrow and beg him. Hmm. Let us nurture his pride and make him believe that he has won over us. <laughs> I will beg him to take me back to my former post. <laughs> then I will secretly find out who and who is still loyal to the former king, my father. Mm. When we've gathered enough support, then we strike. 
<laughs> hey, you are truly the son of your father. I'm so proud of you. Well, I have nothing to say, but you have to be very careful. And I pray may the spirit of your father be with you. Thank you, Papa. Thank you, Papa. I am very sorry, my king. You are the king, and you have all the power to do to me as you wish. I have re realized that I'm just a mere servant. If you will have me back, I would like to come back to my position as court jester. You see, this is what I expected of you. I expected you to you know, think of your life. Because you cannot battle with me. That's right. You can't. So it's a good thing that you've called yourself meeting. And if you realize, service to your brain and realize that this man cannot be toyed with. That's right. If you have been doing this, there won't be scoff for you. There won't be, you know, stressing me to talk too much, you know? <laughs> You're right, you're right. You're right. Well, your position is still vacant, so I couldn't um, find any fool like you to replace that That's correct. Uh, position, so... Thank you, Your Highness. Thank you. I would have asked him to crack a joke for us to laugh, yeah, since he's back. I'm not yet, my king. Uh, yes. So, have you seen that I'm mean, forced to reckon with? Oh, you're right. <laughs> huh? You're right. <laughs> you're what right. I say stands. Oh, oh, you're right. I will always win. Have you seen that? Yeah, I see. Uh, <laughs> you can go back to your duty post. Eh? Thank you. To your position. Nothing is hidden under the sun. What goes around always comes huh? around. <laughs> Just know it. That one day the truth must be revealed. Oh, for but as your kuga wana did you hear that? Too late, too late, too late. Oh, for but as your kuga wana Too late, too late, too late. Is everything okay? Shh. What's the problem? What are you doing here? Are you okay? I don't understand your majesty. I work here, so I decided to come back to continue. Really? Haven't you heard about the rumor going around town? That you are the son of the late Ebubedike? Okay, maybe you are not the son of Ebubedike. That's why you are, you are back into this palace. I don't understand. What oh, don't you understand? Don't you know that the king wants to kill you? I understand how you feel, Your Majesty. But trust me, I came back to be close to the, to the king. Indeed, I am the son of King Ibibidike. And I will take back my father's crown. But I cannot do it alone. I need people that I can trust to stand by me. Good. Good. Very good. You have your uncle and I. Do you understand me? Yes, the only thing that the king just talked to me somewhere he wants to kill me. Okay, Your Majesty. Don't call me Your Majesty. Call me Grandma. Call me Grandmother. Yes, Grandma. Now go. Nothing Fast. is go, 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 go. Under Fast. The sun. Go. What goes around always comes around. Just know it. That one day the truth must be revealed. Oh, for but as your kuga wana did you hear that? Too late, too late, too late. Oh, for but as your kuga wana Too late, too late. Ah, mother, mother, please come. Look who is there. I'm not sick. I know him. He will be the kid's son. 
my brother. Yes. Hi. Finally, someone who can rescue this kingdom from the grasp of that tyrant. And we are going to do it together. I will need everyone if we are to succeed. You know he has eyes and ears everywhere. My son, if you can get me pen and paper, I'm going to write down for you every loyal servant in this palace and every loyal elder and all the important personalities in this community that you can trust. And I will do just that, Uncle. And um, I just need you to bear with me for a while. I will get you out of here soon. Hi. I'm very happy. I'm very happy. Hey, stop there. Your Majesty. Tell me, what are your plans on this palace? Plans? I don't understand, Your Majesty. Don't you dare. Play dumb with me. You think you're smart. But I will tell you I am way smarter than you. Whatever that your plan is, I will stop it. Nobody takes away the throne from my son. I mean, nobody, not even you. Your Majesty, I'm just here to work. I believe the king is smart enough to know if I have anything against him. And no one is taking away the throne from him. He is the king and you will always be the king. I'm sorry, your majesty. The king sent me on an errand. I must go now to avoid this, this anger. Just a little fry, just a little fry. Now fry you. What are you doing here? Your small head didn't tell you you should. Excuse me. Sorry for your miserable life. So, Your Majesty. You said you would take me to Bahamas uh, on the eve of their festival. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes. Um, uh, you said that the country is populated with beehives of beautiful girls, right? <laughs> I don't think I will ever come back if I go there. Uh, well, you <laughs> but because of my duty here in the palace, I will come back. <laughs> oh, mother. You can join us. Candy, what has gotten into that your lousy score? Why have you chosen to ignore my warnings? Huh? What are you talking about? What I'm talking about is the fact that you allowed the person I warned you against back into this palace. Can't you see he's obviously here with a plan? Of course, they make name as if we fight. Man, that boy is here to plan his own life. Talk more of having a plan for the palace. It's just a coward and an entity. You don't have to be bothered with anything concerning him. That's right. It's a nobody. That's right. Honestly, I feel like strangling you at the moment. I feel like killing you. You don't act like my son. No son of mine I carried in this womb. Get back and suckled. Would be so stupid and useless like you are. Why are you mad? What has come over you? Dare you talk to me like that? Do you think I'm that small boy you used to know? I am now the king! 
You have to be mindful the way you talk to me. How dare you? Do you know how I, how I started ruling this kingdom without the help of anyone? That, that's right. Just, just calm down. She's only a woman. Don't allow this to say that. It's okay, Your Majesty. I'm your personal advisor. Are you stupid to call me mad? How dare you call me mad? For my sake, I'm not one you again. Yes, that's correct. You want the room on high. A guy, drop that stuff. Do I now? Nah, I do they do? Beg me. Why, why is he feeling like? Beg me. Oh, God, do this guy, thing. Guy, play, play, play this thing for me. I'll leave you now. This guy is good, no worries. I just beg me, beg me, just beg me, just beg me. Okay, <laughs> sorry, just do I'm done. Touch my bag, touch my bag. <laughs> okay, okay, now fine. I'm going to give you track five now. You okay. know, I've given you track one before. Yes. yes. Are you ready for this one? Yes. I'm Are you ready. ready? You sure you're ready? Yeah, come on, do right. this thing now. <laughs> You know, we are inside the palace. I am sorry. I was just so excited. I couldn't control myself. I came immediately. I heard you were here. What's going on? You're yeah. back to the palace. Yeah, I'm here on a mission. But you know, I need to be on a safe side. So I will tell you the details later. Okay. Later it is. Sure. Later, sure. <laughs> Love a boy. So, that is why I came back to the palace. To find out the king's weakness and to use it against him. So, have you found out his weakness yet? Nothing for now. But I have gotten few people who believed in my cause. And they are willing to stand by me whenever I'm ready. Interesting. So, tell me. What is the next step? Princess, do you still stand by your word that you stick with me against the king? Yes! I am with you all the way. Okay. I would like you to do something for me. Anything. Try as much as we can to make the relationship stick fast because we cannot afford to lose investors. That will also help in the inter community relationship. That's right. So, with that, we're, we're good to go. So, I will inform them on the day of the signing. I want all the cabinet chiefs to be present in the palace. This is good news, Your Highness. I believe this move will be a welcoming development to our community. Oh yes, of course. Greetings, Your Majesty. A long live the elders of our community. Princess, you know, you're welcome. Thank you. Hello. Is there a problem? Um, I can't bear in good news. Please, you can go with the good news. As you can see, I'm having a meeting here. No, what? this good news is one that you would like. Just hear me out. Okay, I have agreed to marry the prince you want me to marry. But on two conditions. What could that be? Well, the first one is that you release an idol. And the second one is that you agree to do the remembrance celebration for the late king. You must be out of your mind. 
Okay? It must be very stupid to think that I will release the man that tried to kill me. Are you that senseless? Your Majesty, please. I am begging you. I'm not going to do that. Don't even dare. Don't even beg me. Your, your, your Majesty, please. I am begging you. That man has really suffered in your custody. Do you want him to die? What's my no. business if he wants to die? Let him die. He tried to kill me. That's right. Um, your Highness, um, I think she has a point. You think it's right to release him? Of course he is, Your Highness. It's your brother. Oh, that's wrong. That's wrong. I'll think about it, but um, your, your conditions have been met. Uh, thank you. Uh, I'm sorry. Excuse me. What did he say? He accepted. Put conditions. Yes. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. So you see, after the celebration, they will now make the big revelation. Then everyone. We get to know the king for who he truly is. Exactly. Yes. <laughs> so tell me, what would you do to him when you ascend the throne as king? I will hand him over to the appropriate authorities for him, for him to answer to his numerous atrocities. Mm -hmm. If that's okay by you. Of course, it's okay by me. Look, I support you in any decision you take. I am with you all the way. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I couldn't have done this without you. I okay. really appreciate it. <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh, God. C come on, go. Come on, take it easy. Hmm? You will choke. My son, I have not eaten in three days. The little that we are able to bring in the daytime, all it did was invited hunger. Then hunger came with all his family members and relations. They started attacking me left, right, and center. If not that you brought this food, hmm. if not that you brought this food, I would have slept on you. Hmm. Don't worry, Uncle. Hmm. Everything will soon be over. Thanks for the princess. The king has accepted to release you, hmm. but only on one condition that you leave the kingdom immediately after the celebration. Hmm. It's him that will leave. He's the one to leave. This is the land of my birth. I cannot leave. Hmm? Yes. See, I cannot leave since I already know that the kingdom is in safe hands. I can't go anywhere. Yes. Well, Uncle, let me allow you to enjoy your meal. Mm. Please take good care of yourself, okay? But take it easy. Thank you very much, my son. Okay. Thank you very much. Hmm? Thank, you. Thank you very much, my son. Thank you now. Hey! Who put that Question for you, Anozi. My princess, what is that? Ever since we started making these plans, we've only been looking at the positive side of it working. Have you considered the negative side? What if this doesn't work? What are we going to do? You know I'm not going to marry the prince. I only accepted that because you asked me to. I have thought about that too. But I am very confident our plan will work. The gods are with us. Trust me. I believe you. I hope the gods are with us. Just have that faith. Everything will be fine. Trust me. I just have this belief.
He said to my king. Are you sure of what you're telling me? I, I heard them and I saw them clearly. Her intention is not to marry the prince. Their plan is to look after the celebration. That is it. Their plan, exactly. So what, what, what do you suggest we do? Your Highness, greetings, Your Highness. Greetings. That's why you're in my house. I hope I'm safe. Oh, for now you're safe. For now. Well, um, you see, this is what I should have done for some time now. You know, after the last time I had issue with your daughter. So since then I've been looking for the best time to you know, stop over. So unfortunately, I have an errand to, to run around here. I said, okay, fine, this is the right time to come. See Cheo Baka, okay? So yeah, it's about your daughter. I think um, I think I'll make her my wife. You know, since um, what has happened has happened. Okay, <laughs> so I just um, to talk to her. Ah. We'll plan it and know when the the royal family is coming over to do the needful. Um, Your Highness, firstly, I have to commend you for this. I thank you. But as you can see. She is an adult, and I cannot take that decision on her behalf. Well, we also she flog adults. <laughs> we flog adults as well. She doesn't have a choice than to, you know, do the needful. Okay? Of course, you said it right. Yes. yes. Uh, you are the king, <laughs> and your words are finer. I have no option. But instead, please, let us go inside. I'll get you something Going to where? eat. Going <laughs> where? you're funny. I'll be on my way. I have other things to, to do, okay? Okay. So tell her, okay? Okay. Yeah. See, I was 20 years old when I became a king. You know, I... At a very young age, a huge responsibility was placed on my shoulders. But guess what? I did it even better than the late king. You see, a king must not necessarily be loved by the people he rules over. A king must command fear and respect. And God save anyone who may try to take it away from me because they will never, ever succeed. I'm born for this. 
Anyway, I called you here to let you know that I, I have asked for your sister's hand in marriage. Okay. I think it's high time I, I got a successor. It's high time I do the needful. So, what do you think? You are the king, and your word is final. Who am I to counter against your wish or what you say? <laughs> good boy. It's a good thing, you know. I was actually on my way to the palace. Papa, hmm? what is it I'm hearing? What is it? That you want to give Adora in marriage to the king? <laughs> Where did you get that news from? The king told me himself. Papa, I'm still your son. Adora is my sister. Mm -hmm. In that light, it will never happen. Adora will never marry that, that wicked man. That wicked king. Mm -hmm. Never. My son, calm down. You are just flaring up without hearing my own side of the story. Just go there. Get this seat. Let us sit down and I will tell you everything. Hmm? you. celebration you have to organize and members of the late king. It's coming up in three days time. Yes, how can I even forget? I am so happy you agreed. We, okay, so here is the plan. You know, after the celebration, we'll go over to your marriage preparation because your husband to be is coming up on that same day. So we just want to finalize everything at once. Uh, you know. uh, Okay, well, don't you think we're rushing things? I mean, we could give at least a week after the celebration no, yeah, before. Yeah, yeah, there won't be need for that. There won't be need for doing this and pause again and do this one. Let's just do everything at once. And again, I'm also planning on getting married to Anozia's sister. Huh? That's in there, yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, so um, just brace yourself, get ready, because in three days' time... <laughs> We feast. Feast. Huh. Alright, so I just wanted to let you know that we need to be aware. The king has started acting strange. I don't know why. Hmm. Do you think he knows what you are planning? I don't think so. If he does, he will have attacked me. You know how ruthless he can be. You are correct. But that is the more reason you need to be extra careful. Hello? Uh, hey, calm down. Calm down. Oh, okay. Okay, I'll be there. Just calm down. Calm down. What is strong? Is everything all right? It's Amara. I don't know. She sounded tense. Papa, I need to go now. I need to go. Okay, just take care of yourself. Okay? Go. go. But you have to be very careful. Sure. Be Amara. extra careful. I will. Okay. To show you all that I want peace to reign. I have decided to grant the princess's long wish. Anayo here has been released and he will be leaving after tomorrow's celebration. And also that same tomorrow, the princess's suitor will be here to formally 
introduce himself to the royal family. So I want we all to be at our best behavior. That's okay? right. That's right. Don't show yourself. Huh? That's right. Okay. And, um... And you, you have a job. Come here, come, come. Your job is to make sure that the princess's suitor is fine and well entertained. If it entails jumping around to make sure he's happy, just make him laugh. Huh? Yes, Jump like a frog, do anything. But the end result should be making him what? Making him what? Laugh. Laugh, laugh. Good boy. Make him laugh, okay? Make him happy. That will be all for now. I believe we all know why we are gathered here today. In case you don't know, we are gathered here for the sole purpose of remembering the late king. But before we get started, I want to assure you all that we have a lot of things in store and I'm going to be very fast in revealing them. Anna Ozie and Anna Ayo, can you step forward in front of everyone here and be fast about it? You see these two here, they think they are wise. I, I see them as comedians. I say that because I hate it when you think you're wise, whereas you're fooling yourself. This one here, Anna, you killed the late king by poisoning him. Hey! So after a series of meetings with the cabinet chiefs, they pleaded with me. You know, I looked at it from a different angle because I am a good king. What did I do? I forgave him. Then again, he tried it again. That same murderous act by taking my life hey. at the throne room. Hey. If not for the help of my personal assistance here. That's right. Your king will not be standing before you today. That's right. Hey. That's right. Hey. After that incident, they came to me again. I don't know, this is my good heart. We'll all haunt me. I forgave him too after trying to kill me. Hey. Now, what did he do to pay me back? He connived with this other fool here. This one claims to be the late king's son. <laughs> That's wrong. Very wrong. That's, should I call that defamation? Oh, you say a character. No character. <laughs> so, um, this one here also has a plan. A plan of running away with my sister after this celebration you know one thing they, they think they are wise they think they are faster than me well guess what I'm, I'm a lion you can't be faster than the king that's right i am one step ahead of them gamdi you are a liar oh, mom, you sit, you sit down the king is still talking the queen is talking sit down he was the one that killed 
the late king. He poisoned his drink. I couldn't speak up because of a mother's love. Because of this idiot, I sent some people to go and kill the woman that gave the Igwe's second son. She gave birth to the Igwe's second son. I did everything for you. Hmm. To clear every opposition for you to ascend the throne. Hmm. And as you're here, is the late king's second son. Hey. Okay. The <laughs> back I here saved you. I only found out recently. <laughs> Even when I warned you against him, what did you do? You slapped okay. your own mother. So you are out to spill the bean, right? Now I'll help you. Could you please tell the good people of this kingdom that this dude here is not the son of the former king. Hey! So, will you tell them that I got you pregnant and you gave birth to him when he looked as the king wanted to marry a second wife? Hey! Yes, so for you to come out here to pour your dirty linen here is wrong. What's hey! the Abomination! Yeah! Uh, by the power bestowed on me as the Prime Minister of this great kingdom, I hereby banish you two. Yes! yes. 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 Cars! Take them away. The one who wants to knock on me at me. No, let me. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's of your ma. By the power bestowed on me as the only of this great kingdom, I hereby cry you, Ebu Bedike, the second of our great kingdom.